Oh, howdy. Corbs here with another Red Dead RP stream. Excuse me. It's George Hughes. <coughs> the Diablo RP server. Hope everyone's been... Well, what is it? yeah, it's Monday. Everyone's had a good Monday. Mondays suck. But, you know, once you get through them, it's not too bad. Uh, mine was very productive. I went and got myself a new high-vis vest uh, for this weekend because I think I lost my last one that I'm ready for the event bump in and bump out so that I don't get run over by a forklift or something like that. I think we are still in... Uh, I believe martial law is still active in Blackwater. Um, let me check that. So, the announcement for martial law was... Okay, we got one more day of martial law. If we're being uber technical. <coughs> we're being really technical. We've got one more... One more day of martial law. Um... Oh, excuse me. Um, who we got around? We've got a woodman. That'll be that'll be Cyrus Bowman and Jack Harkness. We've got some other lawmen around, which is nice to see. Oh, door's not locked. What about this one? Oh dear. Oh dear. Goodness heavens. Oh, look, here we go. Captain. Howdy, partner. How we doing today? Good, you? Not too bad. I just uh, just woke up. Uh, how you doing? Yeah, good. Do you like my uh, new jacket, sir? That's fantastic. The sheriff would be very pleased. Good. I thought it was a little bit more professional than my uh, fur coat. No, no. You know, I like to rock a coat with a bit of fur on it every now and again. But, uh, you know, especially when you're in, you're in ta you know, you're on duty. That's, that's perfect, partner. Oh, okay. Well, I got told from a couple of people that it, you know, it should fit in with the uh, rest of the uniform, and I was like, okay. Yeah. Oh. But uh, it's definitely still in the wardrobe, hanging up, ready to go. Oh, yeah, you know, sometimes it's good to mix it up. But, uh, well, what's your plans for the rest of the night? You uh, you just on foot patrol around town? Yeah, yeah, I'm just going to do foot patrol. Um, It got a little bit uh, noisy here before, just with uh, the banks changing mm. up their system and the way they uh, operate. Can you tell me what's the deal? We got a we're moving from one bank account to another. Is that right? Correct. And the uh, the new one, uh, you need. I don't believe they have safety deposit boxes, and uh, it costs fifty dollars a month. You kidding me? No, nah, that's it's steep. That's my goodness. When I'm on thirty three cents, uh, yeah, that's that's steep. Jesus. My. My goodness. Okay. All right. Uh, so I got to move all my stuff from one to the other now, don't I? Yeah. Have You, you haven't been shown how to do it? No. Not at do all. Do you want me to quickly show you? If you wouldn't mind, deputy. Yo, scrut. Yeah, it, uh, it took me a little bit to figure it all out, so I thought it might save you a lot of time. I'm not entirely sure, scrut. We, we may see it stay stable, or we may see it... Uh, go crazy again. We're not sure. Gazozo, hello, hello. 25 stream streak. Oh, Gazozo, you're too kind. Howdy. Hope you've had a wonderful Monday. All right, so you need to, the way I did it is withdraw all your money first. Right. And then you might need to come over here to withdraw it. It just depends on the person. Right, I got it. Yep, and then you go over to this corner. Yep. And, and if it lets you deposit it, um, then all sweet. If it doesn't, then you need to go back over to here. Oh, it says it's closed. Yep, so then you need to come back over here, and it should be something like open account or whatever it said. Oh, I, over here? Uh, so it's either one of these. So it's right near here on the uh, table, or it's back up at this gentleman here.
Yeah, it says, uh, you know, there's the option to use my G muscle to open the uh, black water, but it says closed. Oh, okay. I'm seeing it right where I am, if that helps, if that's a better spot. Hmm. Because it definitely doesn't say close for me. Well, that'd like, be it because does it's uh, late at night. Could be, but this uh, this is open for me. Uh, <laughs> maybe that's they, not. Is that, maybe that's because you've op already opened the account. Maybe I gotta wait till morning to. Oh, that's my old uh, old bank account over here. Oh. I mm. think they uh, they they put the. What do you call it? Uh, I don't know how to describe it. The things in uh, awkward positions are a little tricky to find for some people. Yeah, well, I got the usual one right here. Or mm -hmm. about here. Yep. And then, yeah, the only other option I have is... Uh... Oh, so see where it says... So if you can open your uh, your old one, mm -hmm. then you go... What does it say? I'll go into it, sorry. Uh, additional bank accounts. Yep. And then it should be like start up or something. Well, maybe yours isn't working. I don't know why. I know a few people couldn't figure it out. I might wait until morning to. Because uh... mm. I did mine while it was nighttime, and uh, this gentleman said it, he was closed. Hmm. But yeah, if you're happy just to wait, maybe just do that. How strange. Are you 100% sure, Gazozo? I'll let you have a play, but it, um, essentially, you open up your new account. Uh, I had to pay, I think it was $295. Jeez. And then, yeah, and then I had to go over here, and then it um, let me deposit it. Oh, yes, it's closed at night, for fuck's sake. Oh, howdy, Jack. Howdy. That's dumb it closed at night in the bank. But also um, take all your stuff out of the safety deposit boxes too. Just remember. Uh, use your uh, special box in the law department. So it costs yeah. a thousand bucks to have a safety deposit box. Oh. Yeah, they can shove that up there. Yep. yep. I'm not paying that much. Yo, Ash. Yep. It's all grown back out. Hmm. Oh, this is a bit confusing, isn't it? Yo, Feezy. Seven stream streak. Oh, mate, look you go. A whole week, mate. Howdy, Looper. How's everyone doing? I'm doing pretty good. I've, um, it was a productive day at work. Um, got home, washed my hair. At dinner, and chilling out. It's been all right. Oh, another late shift. No. Ah, oh. sorry to hear that. Yuck. <laughs> Those late night shifts. Goddamn. What is going on? Well, I definitely needed to wash mine because yeah, I got it cut on. Um, I got it cut on the weekend, and I didn't wash it over the weekend. I was I'm just gonna go get changed and put my hair up. <laughs> Too easy. Back in a minute, so people don't know who I am. Yeah, no, and I'm like right. this. Oh, hold on for those few days off, Looper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, 
God, I got a lot of an assortment of meat, don't I? Yo, Dave. Going good, man? I, uh... I washed my hair. Um... Had dinner. Played a little bit of Star Wars Hunters. Now I'm just gonna play this for a few hours. A big order. I feel like there's something off about Hughes's face that I... I'm gonna go check that wanted poster up. see if... See if our friend's bounty's going up. Over here. You already got shot 10 minutes in. Well, I feel like Hughes has got extra wrinkle, uh, less wrinkles now. I don't know. It's... I don't know. I think I may have tweaked some some of the lifestyle options a little bit too much. Hey, Howdy. Hey, it's know. you, it's... Mr. S hey, how you doing? Oh, I'm probably just used uh, to him having the short hair and the partner. clean shave look over the last few days. And now it's like, now he's got back to looking like this. I'm like, I'm not used to it. Oh, that's all good. You gonna get them fuckers? Hell yeah. I, I'm good. We had a good drink at the saloon yesterday, so... Yeah. Oh, that always helps, that's for sure. Oh yeah, that definitely helps. Bought no. myself a whole pack of cigarettes, too. I don't usually <laughs> smoke, but it helps. Well, the doctor said it's uh, it's good for you, so... Yeah, I'm that's right. Keep using them. They must be good for me. They make me feel good. Exactly. Yeah, well, uh, you, you have fun uh, out there. I, I wish you the best of luck catching that man. All right, thank you, and I will do. Thank you, sir. Yeah, you're going well, you saw. Ah, oh, there, it's you. Yeah. Because I thought. Oh, then, um, the food started cooking again. If you know what I mean. Captain. Well, yeah, now actually, it's just uh... a matter of waiting until I, I don't know what time do you reckon the bank would open? Um, surely not long after sunrise. Well, if you wouldn't mind just accompanying me to the bank, so I'm just carrying a little bit of cash. No, you're right. Um, I've got a question for you uh, while it's fresh in my mind. Um, uh, someone asked me how do they go about getting a bounty license. I actually don't know. Ooh, I don't know if we actually do licenses at the moment. I imagine if they go about it in a proper way, anyone could, uh, you know, claim a bounty as long as they're not being, you know, with, they're not breaking any laws. Yeah, oh, as long as they're doing it. Yeah. OBC, Dexter and Dan Montgomery do not give their stuff back. They escape prison. Oh, okay. Right. So we'll let them come in there, say we've got their weapons, and we'll just grab them. So Dexter and Montgomery. Dexter Montgomery and Dan Montgomery. Oh, Possibly. okay, got you. Yeah. So if they come in here asking for the gun, say yes, we've got them, then we'll just grab them. Yeah, yeah, too easy. Right. What else has been going on? Um, I haven't been awake too long. Oh, so... cold earn and... John Blacker robbing us for our guns because apparently the East took Dolly's guns. Oh, yeah. really? Yep, apparently they're going to rob us blind until we give it back. Well, I better keep an eye on the back of my head because uh, he threatened me at the uh, the formal dance the other night. Yeah, I talked to him last night. What'd he say? Oh, not much. He was just annoyed that we didn't tell him about his wife being arrested. I told him we can't because I can't do it. Well, it's not like he's got a, a phone we can call him on or anything, right? No, I saw her before. She was in jail. That's why I didn't tell him. So he didn't want to do anything stupid. Yeah. But somehow he found out she was in jail. Well, I don't know. Maybe she wouldn't be in jail if she didn't commit any crimes. Maybe, maybe she's only should. in jail for three hours too. They broke her out still. Oh, that's nothing. I know. Oh, I'm gonna grab my other guns. Just uh, while you're in here, sir, with what you got, I might just make sure everything's locked. I appreciate it. Do 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 you know what time the bank opens or is it just after sunrise? Oh, I should have no clue. Yeah, I've never actually Maybe paid like attention. Seven, eight, nine AM the, bank, the bank's never used to close. I think they need to change that too. 
Oh, no, you will alert this is beyond stupid. Oh, I oh. can't even use it. Oh, dear. We don't even get told what it is. That's very vague. They go, oh, this person's looking for you. It's like, okay. But I had an alert before, and I couldn't even... Oh, you have to do something else now. It's, um... Yeah, I think I know it, but, like, I uh, thought about alert, alert menu. Alert menu. Yeah, you do. Yeah. Slash alert menu, hit enter, it'll come up. Hit it your, didn't even bring it up. Muscle. It should. It said, yeah, it said there was none, right, as I was still looking okay. at one. Yeah, so I was still got rid of it then. Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, that's right. They can cancel it. Is this yeah. right that it's a $50 a month to keep your bank yeah, account? Yeah, stupid too. Yeah, that's steep. Fees. Should be 10 bucks or 5 bucks or something like that. So a lot of people don't have that much money in this county. No, and 33 cents an hour or whatever we are. Like, by the way, we got someone uh, peeking through the window. Which window? Uh, My 12. Oh, yeah, he's, he's moving now. So there's two people. Bet it's fucking Woodman. <laughs> <laughs> one's uh, wearing pink and one's wearing a purple vest, I think. It's just for being in Valentine. That's my... ridiculous. I need to talk to that guy, Riverside. I'm thinking about my my uh, my blinding pick one day. To sell wearing pink, death wound. Oh yeah, <laughs> yep. They go for a, for a bit. I can steal my cattleman's and my double barrel. Who knows? I mean, I've still got uh, the cheapest weapon, so they can have them if they want. That's what we do for all. We just rock around with cheap shit, and they'll just get over it. They'll get bored. Yeah. But exactly. apparently, you can't alert doctors when you're not down anymore. Oh, really? And you can do it when you're down. You can't. No one else can alert doctors. So but actually, makes no sense either. No, I don't know how to explain what's wrong with that, but yeah. Yeah, ask what's wrong with that. We should be able to let doctors because we need to tell them what's going on. Mm, exactly. What if we're dealing with hostage situations and stuff goes wrong and yeah. Hmm. Oh, well, sun's, sun's up. Hopefully, nearly time. For Hopefully, the... it's up. It should be up, yeah. Let's have a look. We'll All go right. out the back door. It's easier. Sounds good. There's only one door we have to screw with. That's what I've been thinking. If anyone comes in here and they don't want to leave, throw them in the cell for 10 minutes. It's like that, eh? Hey, think about what they've done. Humans. Um. Um, I don't... I'm not sure. I haven't. I had a very vague look at the announcements looper, um, but from what I gathered, it's the same. I walked in. A bunch of people got shot in Saint Denis. They just left. Oh really? Eh, not a jurisdiction. That's a law around. It looked like. Well, if they need us, they'll call. Yeah, but we're not allowed to go over there. If it's not them calling us. Oh, yeah, yeah, unless the sh yeah, sheriff's called. Yeah. Still closed? What the hell? What time is it? I actually don't know. I'm going to have to go shower. It's just after seven. Hold on, Jow, come with you. Oh. Get that brain power back. Take a knee. You feeling better? I didn't want to get sick. Hopefully that killed a bit of time for the... Oh, hopefully. This new system is just... I don't know. What's going on here? I've been just mucking around. Is that who I think it is? Ah, uh, they need to take the guns off the back. Really? 
really have to tell you. Ahem! Oh. Thank Sorry, you. I got new colors on showing everyone. That's okay. You can show them out of town. Yeah. You're so mean to me, George. Uh, that's the law! That's oh, literally that's the back. law! George unfairly targets me. Yeah. Who do I complain to? You can complain to Hawkins. You can talk to the sheriff and he'll tell you the exact same <laughs> damn thing. <laughs> And then if you don't like that, you can tell the marshal. Guess what? He'll tell you the same thing. And then even the governor. No, I then had the a, president I had for a buggy like ride with the marshal. Hey, we're friends. What's yeah. the marshal's name? Wait, sorry. Ames. Oh, Ames. Wyatt. I thought you were talking about the governor. Shit. Mm -hmm. And yeah. the governor's dating my friend. So I'll make friends. They ain't me. dating. They just and, went on. And then I'll tell. Well, then you're not as up to date as I am, George. Well. I'm not, I'm not in all the sewing circles then, I guess. I'm not. I guess I'm just a better detective. That, that hurts me, Miss Kane. <laughs> that hurts. That got real deep. <laughs> I gotta lift my game. Oh, no. Going to camp. No, oh, I don't remember it saying join account. I've looked at so many different paperwork though, so it's a bit tricky. What? Open account. Where do I put the money in? Cyrus? Yep. So I've opened an account. Now how do I put the money in? Uh, so you go over to this corner. Oh. And I've helped a few people out, and the one thing that they don't know is... The I gotta do amount. it like I'm this? Sure you know that, but it's just to change the amount. Do I really uh... have to scroll to the right? No, no, no. So change the hop amount, and okay. that'll change the amount you're uh, putting in at a time. Oh, fuck me. Oh, fuck me, dude. Oh, fuck me. The fuck? Cyrus, I put my hopper man as a thousand dollars and it didn't go anywhere. Hmm. Is it definitely opens? Like you've oh, paid hello. the uh, opening fee and stuff like that? Yeah, I, I. Yeah. Yeah? Hold on, let me try again. Because, yeah, if you've paid that fee, mine just went straight in. Oh, hello. Mr. Hughes, Mr. Cyrus, it's Jeb. G'day, Jeb, how you going? Well, oh, hello, Marshal Ains. Rush, uh, rush hour in here. Yeah, well, new bank, new day, I guess. Gotta go get going, but it's nice to see y'all. You too, enjoy, man. Your hop's not working. Hop's not working, I can do it the the normal way. Oh, you can do it in the uh, dollar amounts, but yeah. not anymore. Yeah, look, Cyrus, I'm gonna be a minute. Yeah, you're right. This is scuffed. This well, is I don't want to go to strawberry. Fuck me, dude. Yeah, I can. Uh, like, the hop would help, but it's not working. Why is... Oh, is this... You're right there, Captain. Everything good? Oh. No, Marcus? Oh, I see, Tom Loy. Right. Oh, I see. What I have in Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay, that makes, that makes more wolves. sense. A... Thank you. How you going, Harkness? 
Okay. Right. Thank you, Tom Law. You're my fucking hero. Ames, I was still using that. I'm done. Fucking better be. Hey, you left the attendant by himself. Gonna go move my money around. Yeah, same. Oh my god, is that Mr. George Hughes? I had it, partner. How you doing? George, your beard grew back so fast. It is. I spent a little bit of time down uh, down New Austin Way and you let it grow back. Oh, that's nice, sir. That's nice. Looking mighty fine, sir, I must say. Thank you. How you been? Yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. Hey, I just I just realized I'm sorry. I didn't mean to have a long arm on my back. Nope. Wait, the main thing is that you realize and you're dealing with it. I appreciate that. Now, honesty goes a long way. Yes, sir. I, I like to be honest. That's good on you. Well, I better get out on patrol. I've been dilly-daddling around trying to figure out this goddamn new bank account, but I think I got it. Yeah, same. I've been about to figure it out, but yeah, you have fun, sir. Get them criminals. Yeah, I'm just taking everything out try and figure it out myself. What else do I need to take out? Did you get it working? Yeah! And I just gotta transfer the last of it to the locker at the ba at the department and then when I'm good. Yeah, alright. My what the hell was that? You hear that, Cyrus? Yeah, I did, sir. Did you hear where from? No, I feel like it's over here, but I'm not 100%. Let's take a quick look. I need to get some, uh... Yeah, it wasn't hundred percent. Yeah, it could have been. Let's could have been someone hunting. Um, and then I wrap this up so I can go out on patrol. I've been wasting too much time. Where'd Cyrus go? Maybe he's not coming with me to the department. Cyrus is dead! Oh no! <laughs> no! What's all this shit? Dumping water there. Fucking litter bugs, that's right. Let's go check the telegrams and then let's get out on patrol. Only took fucking half an hour. <laughs> oh Ash, I had I was I was that was so that was accidental getting Hughes that drunk that fast. Um I thought I thought it would take a bit more for him for people like I was so used to how it used to be. Yeah, that was such a I was like, uh oh. It was pretty it was very funny. Lots of drama. Silly George. Classic Hughes. Fucking everything up.
Where's Jack going? <laughs> He's like, I see something. Come on! My planet needs me. What's he running off to? Jack? Yeah, Marshall's around. <laughs> Jack, these you alright? These aren't any gang affiliated colors or yeah, anything. Yeah, but they're like still that. colors you match. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, can't, it, yeah, it can't even. You Apparently, can't look a like color. a Parsi. Can't yeah. even be cute. Man. Uh, no. I know. I mean, if you take that poncho off, then you're not wearing gang colors. Well, look, here, I'll say it again. You, you can look cute out of town. <laughs> yeah, so you, you, take your poncho, you take your ponchos off, you're fine now. Wow. That's what I'm being told to take off our poncho. No, you can. No, she's, you've got one on. That's okay. Oh, no, no, no. She can leave it on. You gotta Wait, take it off. Wow. You gotta be the journalist. Okay. No, leave yours on. I'm a big criminal, Why? guys. I'm gonna leave town. Gang colors. They're uh, posse criminals. Yeah, I know. But we're from afar, told you look like a. They, they look like a dangerous posse from afar. I don't want to. Don't they, yeah, Jack? Uh, yeah. Oh my god. We're being told not to match colors. Posse. <laughs> not anymore, you're not. Uh, See, now you're fine. We're not matching anymore. Oh, your girlfriend's now run off, okay. Zoe. Yeah, no, this sucks. Sorry about that. We've got <laughs> you hear that? George is bullying me again. He targets me. George is bullying me again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. That's funny. All right. Better send a telegram. It's been a minute since we've sent a telegram to Ms. Waller. Wheeler! Get my W's mixed up. Uh, 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 uh. Telegram, I don't know what to call it. Miss Wheeler. <laughs> I'm hoping everything has been fine since I took my trip to Redacted for our recent law operations. If you had time, if you had time tonight or later this week, um, please feel free to send me a telegram back or find me on the usual patrol route. If you'd like to grab lunch, Dinner or summer. Kind regards, Captain George Hughes. Yo, Cam. <laughs> Todd? Hi. Hey, Dawn. Good, how are you? Oh, I'm fine. I'm just. These new, this new bank account system's confusing. I want to rob a bank myself. I'm over it. Don't talk like that, Todd. What, what's got you into what this? Was that? <laughs> you know what I mean. No, that's frustrating, the new bank system. It is. It is. Lucky I had some help. Well, I found the dollars for uh, five storage slots. It's a highway robbery. We've got personal lockers at the department. I know. Okay. Imagine you've just come into the country for the first time, right? You've just stepped off the boat. Yeah. You go buy yourself some guns. You buy yourself a spare one, you know, to put away just in case something happens. You go to the bank to go put it away. Oh, you're going to now spend a $1,000 to put that gun away. Well, tough shit, kiddo. You can't put it there until you make a $1,000 now. What if you got a cheaper wagon and just put it in that? Again, like it used to be, we'd have 20 slots or whatever as soon as we got into country. Sorry, I don't agree with uh, what they've done here. Look, maybe, yeah, give us, a, you know, five or ten to begin with and then you pay it, for more. Exa exactly, like, so people can store, you know, their most prized possessions. Hmm. Well, yeah, I see your point. Well. Hey, woman. All right. Anyway, I just got back from St. Denis. I was shot. You were shot? Right, so. What? Why? Yeah. Who uh, shot you? Yeah, yeah. No, um, I bumped into Jeb, and then uh. Yeah. Oh, how's Jeb doing? Uh, not much, you know. And then 
run through town, store some fellas in masks. Yeah. Ran into yeah. the bank. So Jeb headed up to the bank and uh, one tried to drag him in and uh, pass the by, but uh, they stepped back and avoided it. And then uh, they pulled a gun on Jeb and they started firing. So then I started firing too. I hit a, hit a couple of them and I was pinned down for a while and then it was quiet for a while. And then out of nowhere, these three fellas come running around the corner who I don't think were involved in the bank robbery. That's not good. I think that's all right. They come around and they just shot me. Oh, oh fuck's sake. Um, and, uh, and then I, I swear I heard your voice, Hargris. Were you up there? I think I was for a minute, but then I had to go on my head for something. Right, okay. Anyway, uh, and then, uh, yeah, someone, I don't even know who eventually carried me all the way to the doctor's I think office. I think that guy of his friends did it. And, and Miss, uh, Cynthia and, uh, the other doctor man, uh, helped me back on my feet. Oh, that's good. Oh, good. Uh, we're going to go up to Strawberry with Marcus to help him. Okay. I think that's where the Montgomery's hang out. But yeah, it was a bit of a bit of a. I don't. I, I really actually don't even know what happened up there. You know, it makes no sense. Sorry, that's hard. Well, well, we heading oh, to Strawberry, on, are we? Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, can I just get changed? This is yeah, it's fine. Yeah. yeah, there's four of us now. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm still carrying shit weapons. I don't feel like getting robbed. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, carry your shit weapons with you today. Oh right. Uh, I, I I had my Springfield, which has a scope on it, which is worth seven hundred dollars stolen. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Todd. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not happy. But yeah, Cam, that's all what your characters just aren't saving. Well, are I don't know if these people that shot me thought I was part of the bank robbery or something. Yeah, I'd go text board in the Discord because uh, that's. I, I know, I'm just so goddamn confused. That could be happening so to other happen, people, you know. All I was trying to do was get Jim's body back. And I'm annoyed that I only had this shitty little repeater. Um, to attack him with, rather than my Springfield. That's like, annoying. Man. Uh, that's why we'll head up Strawberry in a second. Yeah. Howdy. Oh. Howdy. What happens off your back? Good. We'll go farm Wolven. He's just getting changed. Good eye. I didn't even see him, eh? Yeah. Uh, Kyle Dern's having a buck and cry about his wife's gun getting confiscated. So he's got. To, yeah, just let you know. Again. So be careful when you buy yourself. Okay. Yeah, but... I just randomly fall off my horse. Oh, hi, Todd. That should be safe. They steal your horse as well, do they? No. <laughs> I'm just being lazy. Oh, jeez. Let me eat my brain. Okay, alright. This horse just wiped us out. It's like. <laughs> For your horse? Oh, that's Woodman's horse. That's yeah, Mr. Roscoe. Yeah, Mr. Roscoe. Oh yeah. How long is the uh, I, I thought martial law finished today. What happened? Yeah. Tomorrow, Tomorrow probably. Tomorrow. You have to talk yeah, to uh, uh, to a marshal about that one. Yeah, we fight out last. This were sheriffs. All right. So no weapons on backs. Oh, yes. I just got speakers on. Sorry. Okay. All right. <laughs> Woodman hey, wants a hug after losing his guns. You. Over cool. the dogs. Pardon? Yeah, he was wearing a he was wearing a black mask. Oh, more mask bandits. He's, he's just behind you guys. Oh, he's, there. He's riding Hughes, up now. Hughes. See behind you. Out of partner. Sheriff's department. Sheriff's department, if you could pull up the horse, please. 
there's a pop in again. Warning. Second warning, son. If you pull over the horse, please. Hey, Ari. Oh, God damn it. You almost got shot. No, I didn't. God damn it, Lou. I swear to God. Boys, come. Not <laughs> so close to my head. God damn it, you Lou. You seen Kyle Dan around, Lou? Nope. If you see him, he, he stole my Springfield with a scope on it. It's worth 700 bucks. I'm pissed. Keep your gun pointed at me. All right. I'll, uh, I'll keep an eye out. Yeah. You gotta remember, I need to uh, make this look as oh, yeah. Yeah. genuine. No, uh, I, I'm fucking pissed off. All right, I'll keep an eye out. If I find him, I'll uh, let you know. And uh, no mask in town. Yeah. Yeah, about that. I'll shoot your horse next time. Bang, bang. God damn it. Well, we're on to something then. It was just low. Hey, if we bring in the bounty of um, the Montgomery, do we get the grand? Uh, no. Oh. I think we do. I don't know who pays it. I don't think we pay. I think the. Um... Oh, oh, I'm going to go give him to Walter, and then Walter can bring him in. I'll split the money with him. Yeah, but he's taking them to the east. We have to pay for it, he said. It doesn't come out of our ledger. No, I'll still make five hundred dollars. Yeah, but keep it to yourself if you're gonna do stuff like that. You, you don't wanna come into it and get burged? No, thank you. Why not? I don't need that on my conscience. Just money. Yeah, and I like to, I like to be able to sleep at night. Technically speaking, should the uh, jail pay for the bounty? Yeah. You would think so. Yeah. Save lost it. Yeah. yeah. Actually, I don't know who pays for that bounty. Seems like a lot of criminals are breaking out though lately. You would assume the government. I put that was supposed to be yeah, a threat in all the security. It seems like it's worse than ever. No. Yeah, what are those government. prison guards doing? Like, Not absolutely doing job, nothing, it seems. On strike, I think. Like, one of them was supposed to be in there for six hours, he did 30 minutes, and he was out. That's not good at all. In Hartness and I saw him, but it was when we were all trying to work out our bank accounts, and we were like, well, it's a bit scummy if we grab him right now. Yeah, nah, good call. You know, like sometimes you sit there and you go, ah, oh, everyone's going to try and work this shit out. That's right. Yeah, no. You got to be fair. It's not our but then no the fellas going up into cliff. banks waiting yep. for people to take out their their money to transfer it and then robbing them of that money. Oh, that's we're, disgusting. We're about to go in the office or? Oh, I don't know where they are. They might so, have left Which by, yeah. is really, really scummy, you know? Jack and I will play fair. We'll turn up this way. Jack everyone's up here. There's someone here. There they are. Got it. Got it. You all good now? Yeah, I'm good. That's Marcus. Assumes. Yeah, he's Marcus. He's alright. Where, where's Marcus? He had to... How are you, Woodman? He got a tree by a dock. He had a quick nap. His eyes were all fucked up. Oh, that's not good. He'll be uh, back probably any second now. Oh, that's good. What are you doing, bed again. Uh, Looking for these fucking Montgomery's. Uh, you didn't find Kyle Dan and John Black? Are they worth money? Oh, they, yeah, they are. Hundred well, bucks. Okay, yeah. apparently when you escape Sisica, you break out of Sisica, your bounty's a hundred bucks. But when you break out of Sisica, your bounty's a thousand dollars. I don't care if it's a hundred or a thousand. It's justice to me. Yeah, that's fair. Well, for oh, me, and, uh, you know, um, the, man stole, the man stole eight hundred dollars worth of equipment off me. So yeah, uh, John Block's worth a thousand bucks too. Yeah. Well, yeah. it's both of me. They get justice, I get money that I can give to my wife out of county, so yeah. it works yeah. for me. Yeah. Well, I actually don't even know who pays for it. I think the prisoners should pay for it, because that's their fault they escaped, not ours. I'm just going to go up to the uh, east and go, Oi, give me money. They have a bounty hunter license. They're not available at the moment, so give me money. Yeah. I was saying that, eh? Hey, yeah. Yeah. 
I shouldn't even have that around, actually. Let me check. I, I got it, one. I can, I can just collect it and just give you half. I got one, um, I got one, like, week one back after that big tsunami. And then, um, it got taken out my pockets again. So I don't know what's going on there. Paid the, paid the, uh, usual. And then, um, yeah, it's not, not looking around, so. Um, oh, no, there's no documents for it. So, guess what? Yeah. You're bounty hunting. Yep. We can't charge you for it because there's no bounty hunting license. Is then... Sorry, I haven't actually done it yet, but I just got told probably like 20 minutes ago that mm. don't you just think documents? I haven't done well, it before. Like oh, I said. There's stuff in there. Depends if it works oh, or not okay. anymore. It's yeah, probably because it. um, they haven't uh, given you your jurisdictional headquarters of paperwork for it. Mm, yeah, okay. Because they've split them. So you'll have to wait for the yeah, government to, to send over a bunch of paperwork, like uh, application sheets and such. Yeah, got you. Well, we better get out of the way of this wagon. Oh. Ah. So, um... Somehow, after getting shot, they came back. What they, what they take from you? Schofield and what was the other one? Schofield, which had a scope on it. A <laughs> Yeah, and was, full, of mud in his mouth. and was fully upgraded. God damn. And, and they took my uh, Lamat, which I was about to sell to you. Is that, the, is that the scope that I just sold you? Yep. And you know when I told you to take only the gun out in your hand that you wanted to put it on? Did you instead have your Schofield out? No, I, not Schofield. Sorry, um, Springfield. Oh, Springfield. Fuck. I'm like, okay. Yeah, yeah. No, sorry. Man's, man's gone around with a... No, so well, I, I had it on my roll, like I took it <laughs> off that and put it on the other one now. God damn. Hey, speaking of which, um, I think I got, I got three scopes left. Yeah, well, I'm not buying another one anytime soon. All my money's How gone. much do they go for? Four hundred fifty dollars Could it be insured, the scope? I need a bit of weaponry first before I look at them, but... Ah, uh, look. Sorry, I was getting, getting a higher calling there. Um, uh, so currently for active law, all right, I got them in there for 450, which is pretty pricey. Uh, everyone else is 500 unless you just have a quiet word to me and, um, I'll fix this up. I'll, uh, I'll save my, my 33 cents. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I saved up for that fucking scope. Is that a way we could do this? Yeah, there is. The other way... Uh, yeah, is we rob you. Well, uh, I don't have mommy, do I? Oh, that's true. <laughs> hey, can, you, can you get your card out again, Walt? <laughs> no, they're, they're in the um, they're in the shop. Did I? Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's right, I, uh, I put the uh, the draw keys in a secret location, you'll never find them. You keys them, don't you? Wow! Either that, or I use the... Um, the back door, if you know what I mean, the old bolt sister. Hang him up by uh, that. The prison purse. That's it. Thank you for that. <laughs> Where's Wolfie? Hey? 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 Over here. <laughs> where, where was that? Standing right next to you. Oh! Good job, Todd. What? You He's run fucking there. For like the last like five minutes. Right here. Yeah, right. Oh, I wasn't gonna. I wasn't gonna give it up too early. Here. Hello. Very observant there with your scope, Schofield uh, there, Woodman. Yeah, I don't think, I don't think <laughs> you need a scope. <laughs> hey, I got I got shot thirty minutes ago. Oh, I'll yeah. sell you some improved binoculars too for a fee. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> already got some. Anyway. Maybe some um, spectacles. So, uh, yeah, we know one crew that needs the, uh, the old wolf special there. Fucking asshole. Oh, Who's that? Caldern. Right. Went and stole 800 bucks worth of shit off me. So they do that in front of my fucking store? Yes, Walter. And you stood there and watched them carry me off. I was up having a quick nap. All right. Listen. Yes, they you. <laughs> they saw me. Oh, they pointed the gun at me. I just walked off. Oh, so oh, you, didn't didn't say, you didn't see me, Mark. God damn it. They had a fucking two guns on me. 
I didn't know who it was either. Sell your replacements at past uh, part cost anyway, so it's like at least not too bad. I didn't know who I was. That was one good thing. I just want my original gun back. Where does this man yeah. um reside? We don't know. He's sure? wanted for breaking his wife out of jail at the moment. Right. I see. Yeah. He likes hanging around this area. I think. Strawberry. Yeah, he does. He likes Strawberry Valentine area, of Blackwater. I think he goes down your way too. But yeah, he's targeting. Oh, he does. Uh, he's targeting sheriffs for their weapons at the moment because oh. he, he doesn't like that we take their weapons off them when we put people in jail. If you reckon Get he's worth back. even even a dollar, I'll go after any man. Well, he's worth a hundred dollars on the board at the moment. That well, looks good to me. John Black's worth a grand. That uh, that gone public yet or? Yeah, it's all on the wanted board. You can go yeah. check it out at the. Uh... But no one looks at the wanted board. No. So uh, yeah, Montgomery's as well. God, there's a the fortune to be made out there today. But well, Montgomery's are a bit special, so you'll find them. Hey, does anyone know if uh, well, Terrible's yeah. going to come past and try and collect their weapons themselves, the idiots? Who? Hey? Yeah, they want them but, still, so we're going to wait. Montgomery's want their weapons back, and we're like, just come past the uh, station. What here? Then we grab them. Then we just grab them. Wait, they're coming here. No. They're looking for us either Valentine or Blackwater. All oh, right. All right. Well, what what are we Is doing here again? Up? I don't know. We're just gonna see if they're up here. So that's where they hang out apparently too. I'm just a delivery uh, man. Should go to Valentine's either there. Yeah, I guess so. I'm gonna go back the other way anyway. Yeah. Finally get the shell casings in, would you believe? Oh, about time. Yeah. So we can head oh, up to... Um, actually, Harkness, got, yeah, we've got a dude need to speak to you about that. Oh, okay. I think I can go... I think I can go as low as 650 for um, Express ammo. Oh, very nice. If you bulk order, yeah. Where up, oh, okay. So oh, yeah, sorry. I was, I was right, thinking boy. about a really good joke I thought of earlier today. Oh man, but yeah, about 25% about off for you, I can do. Train, ain't bad. That's good. <coughs> Don't worry, we'll get your guns back there, Woodman. Alright, come on. I'm not leading the way, I always lead the way. Come on, let's head out. Just a civilian that happens to be going the same direction. East, would you get paid as a as the West Sheriff? Well, because at that point you're private citizens, aren't you? Or you all cross deputies, so I guess that would. Well, my horse was slow compared to everyone.
Oh no, what happened? I think, it uh, I think they stacked in the bridge and like oh, did a whole lot. Can fuck do, we, do I really need to tell them to go single file on a fucking bridge? I think you do. Think fuck you me. Do. You do reckon it was, Woodman? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, no, no, no iron sears. Yeah, Fuck's happening back here. Oh, I need to catch dead. a lift with one of y'all. God damn. Yeah, yeah, Woodman needs a lift too. Who didn't who's go it? single file who's, on who's a bridge? My uh, horse half slid off the road. I came back on and collided. Okay, yeah, just just. Yeah, yeah, it was uh, you to go to the horse killer. News flash. <laughs> Newsflash, single file on a fucking bridge tunnel. <laughs> just, just, uh, just an idea. Hey, hey who trained Woodman? <laughs> Not me. Someone owes me twenty dollars. <laughs> Jesus. Goddamn. Part to the sheriff special. Hello. Out it. Is that everyone? I always slipped off the bridge. Yo, Hans. Oh, for me, for once, it was wasn't me that crashed the horse. Dear, oh dear, eh, Luba? Goodness gracious. You know what? If I could uh, put martial law on a town, I'd make everyone wear silly hats. That's ridiculous. Why? Hey, Mrs. Phenom. What's the what would that what would be the benefit of everyone wearing silly hats? Because then at a distance you could see who's the bang martial law and who's those on. I guess. You know. But then what if people just pretend? Sorry? What if they just wear a silly hat but they they don't mean it, they just pretend it, and then they surprise you with well, still stealing your gun. Bang martial law. Was it Valentine? Can I borrow $35, Hughes? Not right now. Okay. <laughs> How long are you keeping that loan open for? I can give you 35 bucks if you really need it. Alright, oh, it's just to get my horse back on its feet. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'll give you 30 something. Is it 35 or 25? Uh, it's 45. Oh my fucking god. Wait, what? No, you're lying. No, it is. It's 45, partner. 45 now? It's going up, yeah. It's oh, like that. I hate the, it. The bank system. It's, it's How much fucker. do you have on you, Woodman? Uh, uh, 74 cents. Ah, oh, damn crazy. That's what it is. Stupid, isn't it? I'm gonna get some money. God damn, Woodman. Hey. Who trained you, Woodman? Uh, Was it Hughes? Was not. <laughs> Why is there so many wagons over here? What the? Hey, that's just asking wagons. the same question. Oh. Well, that's a first time seeing something like this. Looks almost like a race. Now look, I've heard about the, the stable owner here, or the blacksmith or whatever, having stable issues with his wagon, but this is this is getting ridiculous. If he hasn't brought this up with the government yet, he's mm. a damn fool. Get out of here, sir! No, we don't want no trouble! Jesus. Dudes, chase me down the road, please. Please just take me down the road. Ah, damn. What's all these cars over here? No clue. Always gone. Hey, hey Hughes. Yeah. Dare you to shoot one of the lights over there and see what happens. See, see if it sets a fame reaction. I ain't shooting a fucking light. Oh. You're like dominoes. Quiet. God damn well. Hey, Miss Hernandez. Oh, yes. You ain't seen the Montgomery's around here, have you? The black and the red one. 
They're the sheriffs. That's different. I can't take them in for money. Oh, I'm certain. Okay. Looking quiet in town. Yeah, it is. Mm. Yeah. Expansive. You get your horse fixed up? You're spending like... Yeah. Who's that up there? 700 just on one lot of horse training. Up where? On top of the shop. Yeah. He's alright. Hello. Man, we go. Like the the big blue? My hands are cold. Someone might need to calm that horse before it gets someone, by the way. Horse is sick. angry. Goddamn. What's your name, sir? On the porch. Uh, Captain Hughes. Hughes. Hey, miss, you're in my property. Hughes, 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 Hughes. Can we have a word over here? You please? betcha. You want to try that again, Gold? I'm thinking we need to split the group up at least. Ranger, you go. At least half it. it. Information: People been robbing folk at. Uh, he's out the back door. Oh, and they're still there now, on top of that big old the water water towel. It's from the, it's from the Pinkertons. Uh, Wait, where are they? Fuck that. Uh-uh. Flat next well, station. What was it? Gun point back at me. Station. They're sitting on top of the water tower. Okay, let's uh, let's have two groups groups of approach. Yeah. You're gonna have like me going this bait by myself. They try to like, come rob me. Uh, you guys yeah, run in. I like, roll in. Wait, where's Flatneck again? You know where the big train bridge is? Between here and uh, Blackwater, you had that big bridge. It's a oh, bridge. Yeah, it's just a little, uh, little, uh, little well, farmstead there. You know, I split, it splits the trains yeah. there. I think we send a, we send down a, we, we split the group. One goes directly there. The other one heads to the other end of that Gold, train bridge in case screeching. they try to make an escape. Don't you love my voice? An approach from there. I'm done I'll just say with it two groups here. I'll go in by myself. I'm They'll start everybody. robbing me. You guys roll in. <laughs> if you're willing to take that. Just don't go pissing them off. Unfortunately. I'll go in there like I'm going to be selling stuff at the man thing, you know? Oh. <laughs> right, how about I go? Because I ain't got nothing on me. And if something goes right, bad, we'll, you know, okay, I've, yeah, got you do that, yeah. a, I've got carbine and a cattleman, so. Yeah, you look less like a lawman, too. All right, All right, yeah, exactly. There. Let's go get the others. Where the fuck did Cyrus and Harkness and that go? Oh, there they are. Uh, I don't know. Let's group up. All right, Harkness, any other lawmen? Let's, uh, let's rally up. Yep. Where's Woodburn gone for fuck's sake? Any lawman, let's rally up down in the stables. Back down to the stables, woman. What's going on? We will we'll tell you on the way. Right, Lawman, just rally up on me. We're going to just ride a bit out of town and we'll give you the heads up. All right, everybody. Sheriff Wolf's just received word that uh, we got eyes on some suspects down at Flatneck Station by the water tower. Who we who, who we got eyes on? Apparently, there's multiple individuals down there robbing folk on top of a water tower. So they can, I think they're going to have folk mounted up in an ambush-style position. All right, we're going to follow Sheriff Wolf down there, get close as he sees fit. Then we're going to dismount, head in a uh, old quiet like. Sheriff Wolf or the other rangers volunteered to go in as bait. And then we're going to be ready to set the trap. So, Wolf, we're happy to follow you on down. Your call when we uh, slow down and uh, head in sl head, Wolf? slowly. Yeah, you, you, Wolf you going in by himself. I'll stay yeah. with you guys. You know? Yeah, 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 absolutely. So I'm going to go run up ahead, and uh, then you you come in. I'm going to go inside that uh, that actual station building, the flat neck station. Uh, I'm going to try and see if I can get myself inside that building um, or as, as close as I can to uh, to that building. Um, so if I can gain a little bit of distance, then have y'all just come swoop straight in. 
Wait, okay. let's uh, let's get to that. Uh, you see the uh, you got the uh, crossroads to the east. Yeah. A flat next station. Let's head there first and see what we're dealing with. Right. Come up with the next step. We just want to be careful. If they go to make an escape, they might head across that train bridge. So we need the fastest, fastest horseman leading oh, the yeah, charge. I'm fast. I'm, I'm, I'm oh, fast. that would be Miss Sandra here. You'd be surprised how fast he is. Yeah, I should have made more of an indication I was slowing down. All right, we're pretty close to Flatneck Station. All right, do you want me to remain mounted? What do you reckon, sh Sheriff? Um, I would, uh, you know, when you come in, y'all you, gonna see if folk are mounted up. Um, let me, uh, you know, go in as, as the bait draw them all you in. You want to go have a look at the ridge there? I can go in the bush with my binoculars, have a look real quick. Yeah, I, I would say, you know, let me try and draw them all in. Uh, I'll try and keep an eyesight, and then you just trail in. Just give me, uh, you know, three Mississippis before me, five Mississippis. And then, uh, you know, ain't, ain't too much going to be able to happen then. Sorry, Ranger, Got what's your name again? Me? Yeah. Ranger Miles. Miles. Okay, Miles, do you want to make the call as to when we roll in? Uh, sure, okay. Oh, yeah, we'll give, we'll give you a lack. Like, 10 Mississippi's Marcus. Yeah, you're right, partner. You're right. You're right. You're right. Let it stew. Let it stew. Let me draw them all in, and then uh, we'll see what we can do. Okay? We'll wait. Yeah, yeah Miles, you, you you take a peek if you want. You make the call, and then we'll, we'll go in. All yeah, right. I'll go, I'll go on the edge. You see me holding my hands up. We'll go in. All right. Now, Woodman, if, if they go for that bridge, Woodman yep. takes point. All right. All right. Good luck, gentlemen. You too. <laughs> this is fun. Fucking see him. Yeah, I, I can't. I can't see him from here now. That's right. He'll there come he back. He'll come back in the eye side. Hopefully, I can, I can see him. if he does something really out of the blue, that seems obvious. That'll be the signal, yeah. or else he'll come tell us. I can us. see him there. Yeah. There he is. But yeah. Remember, if they go for that bridge, Woodman takes yeah. point. Should have got him to do a signal. Did he happen to say if he'd give us a signal? Yeah. He said he put his hands up. Okay. Yeah, hands up. 
Roll out, boys. Let's go. go. Let's do it. Flat X Nation. Ain't not a soul there, gentlemen. Yeah. I wonder if they're just came out and put his hands up. Oh, right. I see. Damn it. They must have moved on. Fucking hell. Shit. Yeah. Well, uh, it's going to be hard from here. Yeah, they could be anywhere. Absolutely anywhere. I think until we learn more, we split the group. Or a, you know, maybe Captain. maybe halfway. Do you think maybe should we go into you know split the split the lawmen, take a ranger each, or did or was it best if you rangers stay together? Done by me. I, I work good either way. So yeah, uh, either we'll way. Just, we'll just go three out. Like I can come with. Yeah, we'll split the rangers up. We'll do that. All right. Well, uh, I'll, look, I'll take Woodman, and then one of you rangers want to come with us, and then Hogness, you take Cyrus, and to take the other. Absolutely. Miles, go right. go with uh, go with Captain Hughes there. Which yeah, way would you like to go, Jack? Jack, I'll get some uh, uniform on as well. He mix. said Blackwater Strawberry. Blackwater Strawberry. All right, we'll uh we'll head to uh, Emerald Ranch and uh, then head to Valentine and so forth. All right, Captain. On your lead, Captain. We said if we put the alert out. Sounds good. All right, let's head up to Emerald. Not sure fatigue. There's, but there's burglar. There's some mugging happening. We're just trying to, trying to, trying to solve some of these problems. They moved on. Such a shame. Like we learn some information, we 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 prepare for it, but then that takes time, and sometimes they they move on before we're ready. It's cool, hey Ash. It's so, and I'm like, I'm wondering what it's like. Like for you, what's it like seeing Hughes now in a captain position, dealing with Wolf, who's in a different department? Like I imagine it's very different seeing Hughes like this uh, to how it was like. On launch day. I hope there's been some growth. Hope I've learned a thing or two. Where's Mars? Uh, feeding his horse. All right. Oh, that's right. We'll wait for him at Emerald. Yeah. Always like to go in direction on the right-hand side now, because the uh, the drug dealer that normally sits up there always leads from that same direction. Oh, really? And he's got a mule. So if you ever see a mule around Emerald Ranch, you know he's around. Oh, good. 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 You got good eyes for knowing all this stuff, Woodman. Good stuff. Oh, the amount of times I sat out here waiting for the prick. <laughs> nah, no, it's excellent work. <laughs> oh, that's great, Ash. Because, yeah, well, learnt, learnt it all from Wolf. Like, majority of it was learnt from Wolf. 
So that, that is that is a big inspiration. You alright, Mars? Oh uh, yeah, yeah, my Arabian, I don't know what's wrong with it. Is it a new horse? Oh, uh, it's full full bond, so yeah, I'm not oh. sure. Ah. Just runs out of stamina real quick. Bloody Arabian. That's very strange. Yeah, like literally we re-rolled from the crossroads to where a, a woman left me. I was out of stamina. Like everything was down. Everything was gone. I had to like feed his hay and everything. Yeah, how's that work? Is it, this is a Kentucky Saddler, but I thought yeah. I've been riding My Morgan well. is double the range of it. Like, like I was like, I'll say quadruple the range of this Arabian. Would you boys be able to keep watch just for a minute while I... Uh... Oh, was that us? No. Okay, would you mind just watching me? I just need to take a leak. Yeah, go. go. All right. I do actually need to run to the bathroom. <laughs> so we're going to up here. All right, I'll be right back. <laughs> oh, these are lemons. Never mind. <laughs> oh, cold. All right, I'm back. George was no hand in a leak. I'll be here. All right, I guess that. Hagner said uh, they'd be heading to Blackwater and Strawberry, right? Yeah, mm. correct, yeah. Let's maybe go, uh... We'll ride through, uh... We'll ride through Valentine, and then we might sit pretty either down at the, um... Uh, the horse yard, the cattle yard, or behind the church for a little bit. Just, yeah, okay. Just see what we see. Oh, who's this coming in now? Where from? Right. Add upon him. Guess we go fuck ourselves. Was that Lou? What do you reckon, Woodman? I don't know. Add upon him. Oh, oh God damn it! Fucking hell, Lou! Wait, wait, wait! What? Let's, have a, let's have a chat. Let's have a chat. Make it quick. Horses. Point your guns at me. Wasting our fucking time. No, no, I'm not. Okay, so I wanted to talk to you about this yesterday, yep. but we had another issue. <laughs> there is a group that calls themselves the Garcias. They apparently been robbing uh, Garcia Garcia brothers. Sorry, they've been robbing people at Flat Neck Station. And I've been staking it out. We were just, just there and they're gone. Yep. I came back from Blackwater. They were sitting on the water trough. The bridge of the water trough. Just I then? Said, yes, it was at night time. Okay? Oh. At night time. Because it's harder to see at night. So they go there at night. They go there Flat at night. Flatneck Station, water trough at night. Yep. I, I know they're there. That's why I, I rode around it. And when I looked back, I saw two people crouched with masks and guns. Okay. okay. All right. Well, we'll head back there tonight then. No problem. Just uh, make it. Don't make it two obvious. All right. Okay. 
Lou, if you uh, find yourself with needing to find something to do, we've been hearing reports of pa perhaps it's a Cal Dern and Dottie riding up and down Blackwater Street shooting up shit. I heard. I'm uh, looking. Wait, when did Cal Dern do that? Yesterday. Cyrus saw it. Oh, well, well uh, Cyrus saw two individuals doing it, back. and then someone and then someone mentioned Caldon and Dottie in the air, so I put two and two together. Yeah, have a little ride past uh, Hillhaven. We want yeah, to know where they're hiding now. Lou, he's got my fucking uh, Springfield with the scope on it. Look, but I can't do anything. I can't. I don't have the power nope, just to rip anybody. Just if you get if that comes across your you know your yep. path, you let us know where they're where they're hiding, where they're moving uh -huh. around. Okay. I will. All right. Like I said, go past Hillhaven. Have a ride through there. Maybe they are there. Hillhaven now? I don't know. Yeah, I haven't yeah. been past, but they do come around sometimes. All right. Let's do Hillhaven and turn back and go back past Flatneck, I reckon. Okay. All right. Where the fuck's Hillhaven? Uh, it's just the across ranch, our uh, jurisdiction the line. Hillhaven's at ranch. It's outside of Rhodes. Just ride past. They're good people over there, but... Uh, all right, we'll take a quick, because it's out of yeah. our jurisdiction, we'll take a very quick look. All right, let's do it now. All Yo, Chaos. My hands are so cold, but I'm going good. How are you? With the the dance. Look, it went as well as it could with Hughes vomiting on himself. <laughs> but it seems it seems things will be okay. But but we will find out. Not not a hundred percent sure. But it seems like it's gonna be okay. We will see though. Hughes spoke to her the following day, and it seemed like it might be all right. Yeah, that's all right. All right, on to Valentine. Oh, my hands are so cold! <laughs> I need to ride the horse. Captain Hughes on the case. <laughs> Ah, 
Ah, shit. Poor Mars. What's going on? Oh, this poor Mars is Arabian struggling. Fucking crazy, honestly. When was the last time you uh, gave a, your Arabian a good brush? Uh, like when we were at Valentine last. Oh, shit. New horseshoes, everything. Usually I don't like doing this, but we'll, cut a, we'll take a cheeky shortcut along this train bridge. Hey, I'll go over there. No, I haven't had a chance to jump on Albert Groves at all, producer. Just because with the martial law and all the stuff that's been going on, all the events, just it's just been nothing but Hughes. Which has been no, no I'm not definitely not complaining. It's just yeah, no, literally no time to jump on his old Albert. When things quieten down as Hughes, I'll try and jump on and get a job with the trains as Albert. But it's just so much to do as Hughes lately. It's just so busy. We'll ride through the main street, and make it look like we're just passing through, and then we'll uh, loop back around and hide by the church or the train or the cattle yard. Yeah, okay. Turtle man. Hey, sheriffs. Got it. Hey, um, you see this fella on the uh, what is that? Looks like a saddler with the uh, poncho over his shoulders. Yep. That fella yesterday, would you believe, was um, how do I say this nicely for your benefit there, uh, Hughes? Uh, <coughs> asking if certain people were cheaper. Due to certain characteristics, we'll say. Man in the yeah. poncho up there. He's been harassing. I've asked him to leave town because he's a nuisance. Yep. He's loitering. And uh, as a just a general town consensus, we don't want him around here. Is there anything can be done about that? We'll have a talk to him. Appreciate it. God damn it, if... How the hell do people keep going missing? If, if Gold could have fucking said that in a few less fucking sentences, we could have fucking got him. There's Woodman. Hey, well, he probably took my instructions from before, but then Gold had to tell us a fucking monologue. Could have said guy with a shirtless was saying derogatory things. That's right. Where'd he go? 
I don't Where'd know. Where'd Woodman go? That's, that's what I'm saying. You blink and then they're gone. <laughs> it's been happening all night. There's, there's five people at Flatneck. Go there quick. Go there. No one there. Like, oh, to that oh. man with the shirt. Turn around. He's gone. And they're oh. gone. <laughs> oh, wait. That man was with Woodman, though. Oh, shit. Oh, did what? You reckon he took Woodman? Where were ain't, they? Ain't, they were up the top by the church. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Oh, what the hell? Oh, could I be in the department office? Yeah, they might be right under our nose. Good point. Let's, yeah, just to be sure. Woodman, you in there? No, they're not in there. Now it's worth a shot, Miles. Oh, no. he's, he's back on. He's, he's on the other side. He's on the other side. Oh, he's on the other side. Good coming. What's going on? We're looking for you. Oh, hey. I was just, sorry. As as you guys w went in front of me, this fellow came up to me and was just telling me about this other guy that tried to kick him out of town and shot him and stuff yesterday, wearing all black. Yeah, Mister Mister Poncho with the furry hat. We gotta have a talk. All right. You mind just coming up over here, please? Yep. All right, my name's Captain George Hughes. I'm with the West Law Department. What's your name, son? My name is Matt Fat. Mr. Fat, nice to meet you. Now, look. Nice to meet you, too. We just rolled through town now, and we've uh, heard some uh, pretty, uh, pretty concerning rumors that you're, uh, you know, in the market looking for people to buy. I'm, I'm in the market looking for people to buy. Yeah, you're not just, not just any type of people, am I right? Sorry, what was that? And not just any type of person, right? Like you're looking for very specific types of people. I don't believe so. I will oh, work. mate, actually, actually. When I walked in, I had a friend with me, and I said to him, as a joke, how much do you cost? I said that yesterday. Have they taken that into a literal thing of me trying to buy people that I don't know? Well, can you describe your friend? Yep. Uh, green outfit, woman, dress, tied back hair, longish hair, I think. All right. Well, then it may some people may have interpreted that that you're looking for you know cheaper cheaper people based on you know maybe their their sex their gender their uh the color of their skin all these things that don't really matter you 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 catching my drift? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So look, I would uh if I was because this is very concerning to hear you know because you know Abraham Lincoln and you know a lot of hardworking Americans have worked very hard to. Make the country that it is today that we live with equality, that everybody gets a fair chance, no matter you know their their race, their beliefs, their creed, you know all that. Yeah. You know we don't put a price on someone above anyone else over you know color of hair or some nonsense like that. So look, I would make it if it would be in your best in interest that you go and uh, you go and uh, you know make this abundantly clear with the rest of the locals here that uh, that was a joke and that you definitely did not uh, you know mean to be singling anyone out based on anything like that yeah all right all right thank you no well, worries mr that, that's definitely all they're blaming me for right because i couldn't think of anything else they did no. and they were calling me racist yesterday that's it the joke came across as you were singling out people you know certain types of people and that's all they've had to go off now look i you know i love making a joke much than the next person but i can you know i've been on the bad end of you know people misinterpreting it but uh, yeah, I would go make that very clear. I'd go, you know, especially like the gun store owner, saloon owner, bakery owner, anyone like that. Explain it before this gets out of control, right? All right. All right, Mr. Fat. Thank you very much for listening. It seems like seems like it was just being one misunderstanding. I really hope it stays that way. Yep. All right. Me too. All right, go Thank go you, get him. Thank you, sir. I'll be seeing you later. No Goodbye. worries, Mr. Fat. Good luck. Me too. I don't know, Ash. I don't know. I feel like he's, uh, fucking around.
Well, if he keeps fucking around, he's gonna find out. I've given him a pretty stern warning. Yeah. There were none of that, you know. Did that guy just kill that fella? Yep. Abraham Lincoln and a whole lot of people didn't die for people like that to keep running running their mouths. He just tackled him and choked him out. Yo, Dub, my PC's not even that super good. I've got a lot of settings at medium or Hi. high. What are you doing? You boys look badass. Well, thank you, partner. We're just wondering Can't what the hell's going him. on with this fella. Oh, what was that? Uh, what's what's happened with this fella today? Yes, I'm mate. He just got trampled. Oh dear. Y you called a doctor? Um, pretty sure he has. There's a doctor just here. Yeah, you wanna you wanna you wanna wait for some of the staff doctor. You wanna give them a bit of time to see if they come help before you uh, resort to that one. Yeah, fair enough. No worries. Hopefully they come by soon. I think I saw some. Not too long ago. Hopefully they come back. Well, uh, call a doctor, Nathan. Thanks, Dub. I there was last year when I started doing yeah, this. There was so much tweaking of the settings to get it like where it looks as good as possible, but it runs well with um, streaming it at sixty frames per second. Are you boys in, in the gang? HD. Pardon? Are you boys in the gang? Oh no, we're a local law department. My name's Captain George Hughes. Oh yeah. So if any if any crime uh, happens in my vicinity, I'll report it to you. Please do. You know, and that, that information is key. Yeah, you know, right. Fair enough. Unless we're there or we see something, we can't help unless we got plenty of information, and we're we're here to help. Oh yeah. Well, I hope I never see you again. Hope you never. Yeah, I don't want to see no coppers. Excuse me. Well, if you're going to live in civilized society, you'll be seeing a whole lot of us, uh, an awful lot, and you're just going to have to deal with that, partner. There are a lot of copper dogs. There's a lot of law, man. And I'd, I'd, I'd cut out that attitude if I were you. What's the attitude? Calling us copper dogs. Don't really appreciate that. I mean, you are a bunch of dogs. Oh. You want to... The fuck? Sounds like this guy wants to uh, head down to the old uh, oil pit there, Hugh. Fucking dog, you. Fucking pink, cunt. Oh, yeah, you, you, yeah, you would need your boyfriend's jump in. Fucking right. It's all right, we're gonna go down to the oil pit, son. It's been a while. Yeah. Yeah, look at you. I yep. can't do shit without your boyfriends. Yeah, that's right, we're all boyfriends here holding hands. Yeah. I'm singing uh, Kumbaya around the fireplace. Oh. Okay. Uh, hey, George, you see that? He, uh, yeah. magic tricked. Well, guess our work here is done. All right, uh, Flatneck? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I was looking forward to the oil pit, George. I was too. I was just wanting to give him one little, you know. Why, why? Why go out of your way so listen, to I, I just don't want you causing do fuss and trouble shit. around here, right? Understand. Otherwise, yep, I'm going to turn you into those three fucking Bye, Norman right there. I was happy yep, to let it go after that. that. Many times, man. Oh, God, here we go. This again. All right. Well. All right, Tom, you, you want to lead us if down? You, if you change your ways, you I'll be happy. Yeah, that's good. All right. Yes, let's insult three lawmen while alone. tag into the oil pits and just tell him oh we weren't gonna we weren't gonna like take anything off him or kill him or rob him or anything I'm just gonna drag it through the oil pits and be like you know sh fucking deal with it and then leave it like we weren't gonna do anything else it's like you're coming at three lawmen like <laughs> what do you what do you think we're just gonna be like oh yeah and they're like, say, like, copper dogs. Like, okay. <laughs> <I know. laughs> and then, then, then combat logs. I mean, we're just going to drag him through the oil. We're not even going to do anything bad to him. <laughs> it's pretty, like, Woodman's been through it back in before the reset. 
Woodman, make sure you slow us down uh, somewhere out of sight. Sorry! Sorry, I was concentrating on talking to you. Uh, sorry. No, 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 that's my mistake. Yeah, yeah no, bring us I'll, somewhere I'll... close. Yeah, yeah, I was going to say we walk in from here. Do you, do you reckon walk in from oh, here? Yeah. Perfect. Great minds think alike. Yeah. Yo, St. Bellistrad. How we doing? I think I saw you on the ride through Valentine. We are so busy doing patrol yeah. shit tonight. Didn't even have time to stop and talk to you. We are just go, 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 go. Captain Hughes is really having to take on some responsibility. But thank you for the raid as always. Thank you very much. How was your session? I was, yeah, well, yeah, I was just in my downtime at work. It was good to Remember, stay. I had your stream on trough. in the background just while I was, um... Not the tower. Not the water tower. They're there? No, that's what uh, Luke was saying. The horse... Yeah, the horse oh, yeah. trough not tower the thing? Water tower. Yeah, the not... water tower, yeah. All right. No, no, not the water tower. The horse trough in front of the building. Oh, all right. All right, Todd, you lead us in. You're on point. Wow, let's put our voices down. You know, I should probably... Probably helps if I crouch. What the fuck? See if you can see them from, from here. Damn, there's a tree in the way. Yeah, alright. We're gonna have to go yeah. left or right around. Yeah, let's head down to these trees, like, almost directly in front of us there, and sit in the bushes there. That's right, we're on your six. Then it's a cliff here, watch out. You can slide oh. down, it's okay. Oh, yeah, sweet. Woodman showing some initiative in that. This is excellent, I'm sort of... As captain, I'm sort of like, okay, let's give him a moment to shine. Give him, you know, he wants to prove himself, let's see it. Let's see him, uh, let's see him step up. Yeah, you should have, just before Saint, um, this guy was like insulting three lawmen. I'm just saying it now, if we tell them to, you know, they start running, tell them to stop, they point a gun at me, I'm shooting, just let you know. Sounds good to me, Miles. This guy combat logged when we weren't even going to do anything him. bad to him, we were just going to drag him through the oil field. Alright. Seems pretty quiet. Do you want me to walk up alone? You boys get the jump on him? Uh, yeah, but you gotta look like you're money. You can't look like you're a, uh... Oh, true. You know? Well... Don't see nothing. Don't see nothing. What if we keep yeah. circling around? Is there a better approach further around? We can either go more to the right and hug the outside, or go left the outside. Yeah, well, let's go down this valley yeah, here. You're cold, Todd. The left. And then we had someone that was suspect gold sus uh, gold suspected of um, using you know being derogatory and stuff. Um, so I had to give him a strict talking to, and I, hopefully that's cleared up. And hopefully it was just a misunderstanding because there will be no tolerance for fucking that. Looks really quiet, doesn't it? Shall we head up? Take a look inside. Oh, you're lead. What do you yep. reckon, Todd? Uh... What if we what if we stake it out? It might be early in the night for him. Yeah, that's true. Actually, let's uh. What if we go wait inside? Can I go back around the way we came, cross the tracks, and hide in the bush on the opposite side? Oh uh, yeah, yep. I can do that. Yeah, just to uh, just just for a few minutes, just to have. And we wait here, or do we go in? You know, no, we we just wait here for a few, see if uh, anything happens. All right. So normally how it goes is that uh, because the, the closest mountain is Mount Shan. Uh, people delivering will come along the, the bridge just over this way here, right? And oh. Up, and, and it'll come in this entrance here to sell the things to the man. is yep. just in this door here, right? Of course. Now, from, from what they've been saying, they're, they're either hiding inside already, or they're on the other side, sometimes around near the water tank, and then they come out. Shit, sneaky bastards. Praying on these poor people just trying to get by, earn a living in the mines. Yeah. So, uh... Yeah, and uh, yeah, it's a bit it's a bit dirty, but they know that they either have uh, money on them because they've just sold all their stuff, or they got valuables with all the diamonds, etc. They're carrying in there. 
God damn. So, you know, from a FIFA point of view, it's a perfect sort of ambush spot. Yeah. But at the same time, I feel like it is a little cheesy. You know, especially if uh, you're talking to the man and they uh, jump out behind you. Some people just got no honor. No. See, I think the bridge itself is a great ambush spot. Like, if you someone's come across the bridge, you block off both ends with people, and boom, they can't go anywhere. That That's more more of a good ambush spot, I feel, than just doing it at this house. Woodman just knows all this because he's done grinding in the mines to buy all this hey, shit. No, I'm, not a, I'm not a criminal, so... No, no, I know you put a lot of time into the mines. It's really good. It's paying off now. Oh, every time I went across that bridge, right, with, with my stuff, I was nervous as heck every time. And, and the amount of times I, I turned up here and there was other people here, and I, yeah, it was scary. But, you know, we would all give each other the look, you know? Mm hmm Yeah, reports have been coming out several days of, of these, these folks doing it up here now. God damn. Hope Jack and the others are alright with wherever they are. Well, I'm thinking we go to Blackwater after here. See if they're around there. <laughs> Cynthia told you to go to bed. Saw, uh, saw Cynthia in the town, but didn't even have time to stop. Like, literally, it's like... We're, we're, we're trying we're tracking down some I'm so crims so Cougars living around here but have a good sleep saint thanks for the raid I'm again you're in like a steakhouse <laughs> spot and then a cougar jumps out george is just he's just so busy he's a busy boy you hear that what is that i can hear some hooves well they're gone now maybe someone riding by or someone arrived on the other side of that building. Well, we've got miles on the other side. See, we've got all ways in now covered. That's right, Dub. Yeah, reset. Everything everything back to square one. Seems uh, pretty quiet. Yeah, very quiet. Too quiet. Oh, not a hundred percent sure, Ash. Not a hundred percent sure.
All right, sun's coming up. Let's uh, grab Miles and head down to Blackwood. Right. It's Miss Wheeler. That's the lady I've been seeing. Let me, I'll go down and see what the hell's going on. What the hell's she doing here? Well, good evening. Whoa! Oh. Jesus! Why the hell are you sneaking off on a woman with a gun? I ain't sneaking off. I'm trotting on my horse and yelling out. I just, I'm just trying to hunt down here. Uh, you gave me a heart attack. We heard the shots. We were nearby. Oh. You know, I just hunt along this river and along this ridge sometimes. Oh, God. We were full staking out the flat next station there. Why are you staking out a train station? You're looking uh, for a train driver? No, people are robbing folk up there. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know about all the robbing happening. Oh, dear. You, you know, you stood out like a sore thumb with that lantern on your hip. Yeah, because I'm stalking animals, not people. True. Okay. Well, just checking, because. The, the lantern's more for my safety, because then, you know, people won't attack me or think I'm up to anything suspicious. I really wish somebody, with, somebody who's telling the world where they are ain't suspicious. Really well, be careful that lantern, because if someone shoots that lantern, it'll set your light. If you yeah, buy the... I need to buy the other one. I need yeah, to swap yeah. it. Yeah, I know. Wish all the I bank robbers this... would wear lanterns. Why would the bank robbers great. wear a lantern? So that oh, we can fantastic. find them in the forest. Oh. It's got a job easier. Right. Be a hell of a lot easier. Well, uh, how have your evenings been? I know that, obviously, Woodman's probably told you about all the robberies and stuff that we bumped into each other on. Mm-hmm. No, it's been fine. Just it's, it's been very busy with law law business. You check your telegrams today, Miss? Yeah, I sent you one back. Did you check yours? No, I, I haven't had time. I sent you one like two hours ago. Two hours ago? Is that how long we've been on patrol? Uh, I, well, I sent it from when I was up in Saint Danny. So. Well, what what you what you what what you say? I said probably haven't got time to meet you for lunch or anything today because it's been hectic. I want lunch. Oh. And then uh, we were doing ride-alongs for doctor stuff, and uh, we are running into issues where our paperwork wasn't being transmitted across the county. So we couldn't even, people didn't even know we were coming, and everyone was getting hurt, and we couldn't help them. And it was, it was just, we got a real bad headache from it, so we decided to give up. Hectic? You're hunting out here, down at Limpany? Yeah. I just, I hunt, like, uh, there's a lot of foxes that come through here, the gray foxes. All right. Oh, well, if you And, uh, the ducks. Oh, right, well, if you're content on doing that all night, I don't want to keep you from it. I'd hate to... I just, uh, look, here's, here's the thing. I'm a medical recruit now, and I'm doing these ride-alongs for hours on end, but I'm not making any money doing it. And I've had, like, you know, just very little to eat the last couple days, so I'm trying to just make some money for myself a... I hope it's gathered that I would be paying for the meal. No, I understand that, but also oh, you paid another for another thing you pay for. And what's wrong with that, Woodman? Don't get me. 
you've paid for a lot lately and so have a couple other people for being real nice to me and I need to learn to pay my own way. So I need to make my own money or catch my own deer and cook my own meat and then I need to get enough money to pay you back for all your kindness. You don't have to go pay me back. Well, I intend to. Especially so Woodman can shut his damn mouth. Ugh. All right. Well, if you don't want to, if you don't want to go on out on a dinner date, I understand. I'll leave you to your hunting. I have a dinner date. I think Woodman. No! Oh, oh, ah! Yeah, I see how it is. See, he just let his anger out on me. Damn. I'm just uh, dealing with a lot right now. I think I just need some time in the wilds where I haven't been hunting for days. So. All right. Well, I respect that. Oh, okay, won't, great. Won't it's take, won't take up your time. Yeah, I know. I usually hunt in tall trees when I feel like getting attacked by a grizzly bear. <laughs> Alright, well, I will see you, gentlemen. Alright, come on, fellas. And check your damn telegrams for once. Seems Ooh. I didn't need to. Seems you needed to, because two hours ago I was trying to tell you the drama happening where the sheriffs couldn't even get out calls. Oh, shit. Like a bank robbery, and there was a Mr. Gold was chasing after someone because Woodman got kidnapped, and three people been robbed. And I was trying to tell you. All right, I'll check it as soon as I can. Thank you. All right, good day, Miss Will. Bye. I swear Blackwater's that way, but it's this way. I just never get my bearings in this area. It just never sticks. It never sticks. Oh, wait, no. Th yeah? That kind of... Yes, yeah, so we're heading back to uh, Blackwater? Yep. Yeah, Maybe yeah, we'll run into harness and that. Yeah. Hey, Roger, dog. Oh, God. What happened with Alexi? Fucking nothing. Okay. I ain't buying Woodman lunch nutties. <laughs> so what? He said he didn't do it, and you went, and we all went okay. That's that's the long and short of it. Yeah. Okay. I was there. Frank checked his wagons. Yeah. Todd go? He's probably taking the shortcut. Did we lose Wolfman? Where, where did he go? Did he take a shortcut or did we lose him? I don't know. Uh. Oh, there was another bridge. I didn't even... I'm still getting used to it. We can cut down here. We can cut down here, yeah. I, forgot, I was like, oh, we've crossed one bridge. That's all there is. But now there's two now. Rock. Oh, where was it? Shit, oh, I always get confused here as well. Uh, left here, left here, left here. Yeah, here oh, it's it right fucking there. <laughs> he went to get lunch.
Oh. The fuck? The hell's all this? I don't know. Imagine if there was a particular thing you could put garbage in. If only. The hell? Like, what surely the? this is. I don't. I didn't even know you closed this right now. This is water. Despicable. There's 25 water here. That's something at least. Any sign of hardness when you rode in, Todd? Nothing. Right. I gotta check my telegrams. Then I'll come back. Okay. Litter bugs. That's a hanging. That's a hanging. Oh, for bath. I know I can't because I gave him my money to Woodman. Shit. I could shout you a bath. Oh, thank you. What was that? What was what? Oh, it's still like the fastest moving deer just sprint through town. Alright. There's more garbage there. Yeah, okay. My god. We're struck by... Litterers. I see you, Terrence. I see you dressed as a posse. Hi, George. Sorry, probably can't do lunch today. Pandemonium is struck. Jesus. Not sure if you noticed, but no one, the Lord Doctors, are getting any paperwork. We've had lots of problems with shootouts, including a bank robbery. People going down without being able to get help. Pass the word along. Currently, writing to you from St. Denis. Lindy Wheeler. Oh, dear. Lots of... Paperwork issues. I don't think we're seeing anything. Wonder where all wonder where Jack and all that are. Yuri? He's... Is he... I, I'm confused. Add it. What magic beat tonic do you use, George? Uh, just... just... Clean lemon. I have to try it. Thank you. Oh, who's this? The girl is okay? Yeah, are you okay? Yeah, I heard there was some sort of trouble down here. What, was there? Oh. Yeah, I think so. Oh, shooting or something. Probably not while we, we just got here before. Gotcha. All right, will you fellas have a good day? You too, you too pal. I saw Miss Sandra there, uh, Marcus's mule, but uh, didn't see no Marcus. Uh huh. 
Yeah, okay. I think something's happened. Shooting here. Marcus's uh, mules here, but there's no Harkness, Marcus, no one. I would say they've been kidnapped. Someone just going to the government building? I think I might, it might have been a blue coat. It looked like it might have been Ames. Let's go have a look, find out what's going on. Hello. No RP cam? Isn't that Harkness's horse over there? Yeah. That's Harkness's horse over there. And yeah, there's Miss Sandra there. Yeah, and, uh, yeah, there's, yeah, the mule, yeah. And what word is there was a shootout recently. Yeah. Oh, okay. That does not bode well. No. Ooh, there's something. Anybody home? Oh. Oh. Howdy, Governor. Oh, howdy. How you doing? Oh, good, sir. Uh, we just, uh, I'm here with uh, Ranger Miles and Deputy Woodman. We heard there was a shootout in town recently. Um, fortunately, I didn't hear it, boys. I've been writing up some documentation so i have uh been kind of really focused i, I didn't hear anything personally but, but do you hear anything marshall hello oh, i haven't heard shit i only got back into town i was at uh uh i was up strawberry and made my way down the river so i haven't heard anything oh well, yeah. sorry boys i haven't uh can't help you unfortunately you haven't seen any of the other lawmen come through town recently no no i've been behind my desk i haven't seen a single soul Shit, all right, we better get out there. They may be in trouble. Yeah, well, how you take care? Stay uh, safe out there, yeah, boys. The horses, yeah. Oh, dear. Okay. Oh, dear. Shit. Yeah, something's happened here, hey. Yeah. You see, did you see that fellow went over near the station there? Uh, no. Hey, who's that over there? Something, something feels there. real off here. I, like it's just not. I think nothing. we. I think we jump on our horses and we fan out and we check all the buildings in the in the Blackwater area on the outskirts at, as right. a start, and then we come back. We meet here. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. What a clean jump. Make sure you... You're recording that stuff and you're submitting tickets if you need to, Cam. If people are breaking the rules, you gotta you gotta show them that they're doing it.
Oh dear. Where could the, 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 it's all their horses being left around. Where the hell could they be? We reckon so, Ash. Out of the street. Hello, George. Oh, well, that's wow. assault, George. That's assault. Standing in the middle of the street, you should know by now. Get out of the way. Oh, he did it again. Somebody alert the law. Alert the law. Alert George the is law. assaulting people. Well, thank you for letting me know. I'll make sure that he stops. <laughs> thank you. I don't believe him. <laughs> I, I don't know. I'm fucking worried, Miles. Yeah, me too. This is no sign of anything around here. Like everyone's, the, all their possessions are here, but the the like it's like they just like a big old bird just swooped them, took them away. You know who those people are by the train station. Idea. Shit, like they could be anywhere. Yeah. Um, be careful. They do Did anyone get eyes in the department? Uh Hello there. Jim? Hello, Mr. Hughes. How are you? I'm alright, how are you? I'm well, I'm well. Is that you, Sheriff Bowman? Uh no. Oh no, sorry. No. Uh you're a Ranger, right? Correct, yeah, Ranger yeah. Miles. Miles, that's the one. That's the one. Ranger Miguel? No. Have you seen Marcus at all? Oh, uh, no, I haven't. I just woke up myself. <laughs> okay. How y'all doing this evening? Yeah, good. Yeah. We just can't find uh, the others. We're just really worried about them. Oh, uh, Mr. Woodman, Harkness and all that? Oh, Harkness, Wolf, and uh, Cyrus. Cyrus. All oh, right. You seen them? Nah. Well, the we horses just came... around. We came all the way down from St. Denis. We saw one big group, all dressed in yellow. Talking right. about them? Where was this? This was uh, right between Valentine and Rhodes. They were shooting. They're after someone. We pulled over because uh, we got a new person to county. So yeah. We just sort of tried to get her out of the way of danger. Plus, it was just me. So, um, But that was like a group of seven of them or something. But all dressed in like yellow and black poncho kind of looking things. I don't think I've seen that. Yeah. I don't know. I haven't seen that. I mean, I've seen groups in red and I've seen groups in gray and things like that, but yellow is a new one Oh, to me. there he is. <laughs> Hello. Hmm. Yeah, keep an eye for that. Uh, what they, uh... The Valentine. Oh. oh. Don't attack me, George. I'm leaving. Oh, hold on. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, yeah. Sorry, sorry. Hey, Captain. Yeah. You know how in there? Oh shit! I keep tripping over your horse. How in there? How we can you know trade in the uh, the marked bills that we get from recycling? Yep. Yeah. Is that only for sheriffs, or can anyone? I'm not entirely sure. Frank had Frank from the Pinkertons had to. I had to. Uh, I had to do the recycling for him. Yeah, because the only suspicious thing I have there is I don't think is that when Jeb came over, the two women went inside and went straight to the uh, where you trade those in. Hmm. Uh, I don't know like, if we can go off that, but it was weird how they were sitting there watching us for a bit. 
They roll in. Jeb comes straight to us. So those two women go inside and go straight to that corner. Was that one was looking at the door? The other one there was. Was that Sheriff there. Lewis and Tessa by any chance? I have no idea. I don't. I don't know their faces. I just. Hmm. I might quickly try and call the through to Valentine and Strawberry. See if any of the other fellas pick up. Yeah, you know. Hmm. 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 Uh, so what's happened? We still can't find. I'm gonna try calling uh, yeah, through to Valentine and Strawberry. What with Jeb and friends? I'm not entirely sure. Okay. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, there we go. Fuck. Nothing. Where are they? They didn't answer the phone. They're dead. <laughs> it's the only logical conclusion. Anything? Nothing. No answer. What the hell? Who'd you call? Both a strawberry and Valentine. Nothing. Fuck. Shit. Uh, shit. All right. I guess we head up. Do we want to check the dark side right here first? Yeah, Dr. Surgery, then let's head out on the patrol route and see if we bump into them. Uh, this is yeah, weird. Some, something's happened, I feel. Did you want to hit, like, the town? Like, oh, Strawberry, Valentine. That's it. Yeah, that's our usual route. Those yeah, four okay. locations. And then Emerald Ranch is the last spot. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we'll do that. Ooh. Oh, rubbish. One of the doctors was saying they had a call out at Valentine. How how long ago? Five minutes. Fuck. Maybe we head straight to Valentine then. Yeah. Hit go through Strawberry on the way back. Yeah, because look, honestly, the the amount of stuff that's happening in Strawberry is very minimal these days. On time, okay. Apparently, one of the doctors had a call up there. Yeah, I, yeah. Todd makes a good point. Like, if, if there's an alert there, then might not be a coincidence. 
All right, let's ride to Valentine, boys. There are two riders behind me. going on with their horses today. Where'd the other one go? Just... Ah! Shit, sorry about that. Georgie!
hell is this? I'll tell you what this is. Oh, shot hostages breached. I'll tell you what it is. Well, People fucked around a Valentine. End result. End result. Jack? Oh, Rangers. Thank fuck. Uh, Captain. Joe, uh, what the hell oh, happened? Just... Bank Leave robbery. Bank robbery and uh, they all got taken down. They wanted money. They got food now. I shot her. This guy tried to shoot me. I was half blind, chased him down. Oh my god. And leapt on top of him and, well, oh pop god, goes the weasel. Happened? Jesus, boys, I'm just glad to see you are alright. Yeah, well, oh, from flat fine. next station part, it's been a fucking wild ride. Yeah, I've been, really? I've been, I've been shot yeah. the head oh, to oh, 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 the uh, Who we got here on the ground? ground. We swear we saw all your horses <laughs> down in Blackwater. We thought something horrible had happened. Oh, yeah, we did. We, did. I got we, got, we got taken out of town. Uh, oh, it's been eventful. Uh, I'm not too Hold sure. Mr. Sledge, come know I got it. He has a name. Shit, anyone free to give us a... Got a minute? Run down? Absolutely. Yeah, well, let's go over where it's a bit oh. more quiet. Give us the rundown. Hello? Ma'am, excuse me? <laughs> down on the ground, miss. No one fucking strangles my deputies except me. All good? She just fucking broke Woodman's neck! Jesus. The fuck, ma'am? Ma'am, you got anything to say about that? Your hands are cold. Excuse me? I don't know that was her. Yes. Can anybody hear her? No. No. She may need to be taken. Bring her, bring her over here, Miles. Fuck. Woodman! That is Marcus Crow. Oh my god. <laughs> there was, yeah. Doc oh, man, just... Doctors, I'm really sorry. Inside, Woodman just got choked the fuck out. Oh my god. Bam, Woodman. stop. Fuck's going on here? Get the fuck back round here. Hello, woman. Assist, but they might want to move it so you don't get kicked. Somebody want to cuff it? I've got my gun on her head. Right. Yep, stay still. Stop fucking moving. Woodman, come on. Sorry. The hell do you think you're doing? Got her, Jack. All right. Deputy, do it. Oh, I've got to fucking sit down. Try and clear these airways up a little bit. Stop. What? How much am I getting Did she just open the door? Just walked in. What do you need me to do, Jack? Look at that, Cyrus. What the Cyrus? Cyrus, can you do this, lady? Uh, Bill, hey, hey, do with the hey, you, fines. You smell like shit. Oh, well, well, sir, you smell no, like shit, my, too. My bill's uh, not working hey, either. Hey, hey, you. <laughs> this is nice. Oh, well. Okay. Well, Go, you had going back to six. Wolf. Well, of course my mum would stink. My, my bill's not working. Oh, shit. Uh, oh, my goodness. Uh, I'm gonna move this horse just so I don't kill anybody. Lady. What's that? Hey. Well, sorry about that. Sorry about that, sheriff. Sorry about that, sheriff. I don't know what the fuck that was about. No, all good, partner. All good. Like, give I it, believe, give it uh, a little short of Germany. Probably fresh before. up the boat, I would say. Yeah. My God. Right. So. I, uh, yeah. Flat next station, we split up. Oh. <laughs> Run me through, what the hell happened? Oh, Captain, let me, let, oh my gosh, I don't even know where to fucking start. Take you your know, time, Flat man. next station, okay, we split. We head down, we head down to Blackwater. Um, we're there for a little bit, you know, and then it was just 
it was like martial law didn't exist. Uh, you had folk running around, guns, long arms, masked individuals, colors, all in colors individuals. I mean, you, every, everything, everything. More uh, groups, more than four. Um, I, I don't even, yeah, just mayhem. So we got surrounded um by i believe it was six individuals or five individuals um completely surrounded uh there were folk in the bank that were trying to do the bank so we went to respond to that um but they had some unfortunate uh, troubles with the um the, you know, the dynamite so mm. there was folk in the bank then there was these six that come up behind us um and all got us to draw dry hands up uh, so we were in our positions to do the bank and then we got double banked and then um well then we were all taken out all tied up one of the deputies one of the new deputies got some stuff robbed from him uh mr sledge was uh uh the deputy there he knows uh one of them because one of them uh, uh said who's his name was john johnny or something like that right so he's familiar with uh with, with sledge um but they were saying something about, see, this is what happens when martial law is enacted, when we can't run our business, you know, we, we can't conduct our business, you know, then, you know, we might do a couple of banks here and there, you know, we stick to ourselves. But now that we can't conduct our business, this is what happens. Um, and they also mentioned that uh, some guns were taken from them from the east as well. Oh, this, yeah, this is that, those fellas, Harkness and Woodman have been talking about. A Calder or something like that. Yeah, and uh, Mr. Black. That's right. Yes, yes. The Johnny Black. Is that his name? Possibly. Yeah, yeah. John, Johnny, yeah. John Black or maybe something like that. Yeah, I think so. I think that was the, the man that uh, Mr. Sledge knew. Um, so, yeah, so that happened. Um, they all seem to know me. I had no, I have no idea who these individuals are. Um, they asked, uh, they said that next time they see me, they... They hoped that I'd have something signed for them. Um, I don't know why. Um, but I guess I'll get something to them if I could figure out their names. And we got one name, but yeah, it's uh, it's no good. And then after that, well, we head to Valentine to uh, get a doctor for Mr. Harkness. Um, and then we, <laughs> just as we rode into town, folk were in this bank robbing this bank. Oh. Um, so we all responded to that with nothing. You know, we were, we were trying to do medical. You know, I had no hat on, no shirt. You know, I got a spare shirt on and from the department in there. But, you know, we, we try to patch Harkness up the best we can. Um, and then, yeah, now we have this. And then y'all showed up, so thank fuck. She, yeah, we've been out by Emerald, Valentine. We even checked on Flatneck at one point. Then when we got to Blackboard, uh -huh. it seems we just missed you. Yeah. Yeah, horses would still be there, yeah, because we, uh, we got taken out of town. Oh, that is... God damn it. Sons of bitches. Yeah, we, it seemed we were all we we're all very close. But, uh, yeah. All good, Ranger. All good? Yeah, all good. All good. It's just explaining uh, to the captain here exactly what happened. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, quite an eventful shift. So... Leave you alone for five fucking minutes. What do you mean? I didn't even see you on shift. But yeah. uh, it's, it's good that you are. It's good. So what happened to y'all? I woke uh, up in Blackwater, St. Miles. Got my story. Myself, Captain Hughes, and uh, Woodman there, we stoked out Flatneck Station there when it hit night because okay. we got info that the, apparently the those guys are going there at night robbing people, not Woman. just there. Ah, uh, that would make more sense. Yeah. Right, okay. But uh, no one was there. Right, okay. Well, we went from bank robbery to being double Take banked immediately. to getting nap. dragged out of town to here, another bank robbery. Yeah, I'm, I'm going yeah. to check him now, Harkness. Jesus Christ. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know who the hell that well. player was. They seemed very oh, new. Y'all were with... Uh, with that was with whack. Was split, so it was... Uh, yeah, it's just... Did they actually rob the bank? No, they couldn't. Uh, they oh, had troubles okay. with their dynamite. Their dynamite was wet, so that was in Blackwater. And then, but then we got then six individuals who came up in in all masks, and then they 
they surrounded us and then they yeah, dragged okay. us out of town. Wait, um, six? There were five or six. It was, it was so many, partner. Didn't know who was who. Woodman, you feeling okay? No. <laughs> There was at least, the, at least four gentlemen and one female, so maybe five. Yuri got some medicine for you? He gave me some, but it didn't do anything. You need a bath? I don't so I spoke know. to Gold about the prices of fucking short-range scopes. Fucking hell, I have to sell everything I own to buy one. I better go see Jay. Yeah, Jack fucking needs anything. Caldern took my gun with my scope on. <laughs> He's still on about fucking Caldern. To my, to my Springfield or whatever it is. Hell. You're right, Jake. Nasty sight when, uh, oh, I'll be okay. That's state. very sore. Get a doctor look at me anyway. Cyrus, you okay? Yeah, uh, all good. To help me, uh, so. Both of my our heads aren't working too well tonight, and uh, you should be all right. is the only one Rest that can that sounds process. like it's uh, shit. That hurt though. Bit of a concussion again. Be yeah, they fucking execute me at the pricks. Oh, for fuck's oh, sake! What was that? Who knows? Bit of a nasty sight, that one. I didn't shoot, she accidentally... She had a bit of a, um, a wagon pop. What was going on here? It's like a desk pop, she, but she, she, ex she was trying to point okay. at something and she... <laughs> what happened? She didn't practice keeping the finger off the trigger. You nearly shot me head off. Misunderstanding? Oh, yeah, 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 no, no, this is all good. It's all good. <laughs> all right, let's get this wagon out of the middle That's of the road. Come on. <laughs> well, yeah, get I your wagon. Out. Crying. <laughs> she pull, gonna pulls again, a gun probably. to point at me and, and doesn't keep a finger off no! the trigger. Oh my god, missed me head by an inch. Oh gee. Arrest them all. Oh, sometimes I feel like it. Hell no. That's I mean, like, at close uh, range, get definitely will. Get the fuck get, out of here. Get cat, out of here. This, Don't. This is, the cattleman would outdo that shotgun. Come on. Well, I had 50 cattlemen and it was still shit. Parker, you ain't. You wouldn't know 50 cattlemen if they were all on the. What'd you say? You can say Todd. Friend. Todd. Oh God, no. Uh, what? You what? killed him. Something's very wrong with Todd. I think he's sick. He would never do shit. Oh that. God. I can't believe you. He might be having a quick nap to fix himself. I hope so. He got strangled in the middle of the street. He also had a bullet pulled out of him earlier by yours truly. Oh, poor Todd. He's had a rough day. Yeah. You're, are you right? Just, yeah, we're trying to find the other patrol that's been having a lot of trouble tonight. We're just always one step behind. No. Anyway. Did you, have you found them now? We found them now, but they could have used us a lot earlier. And there you go. Right. That explains the stampede Jeez. of little men I saw running through the Great Plain. It's, it's hard to... All right. Just can't be everywhere at once. Just... It's, it's yeah. tough to do the job. Remember, it's not your fault. Yeah, yeah. We'll see. Hello, Miss Eerie. We get, unfortunately, one of the patients could be, uh, could be saved. Oh. One of the bank robbers? Yeah. I, I, I assume they're one of the bank robbers. Oh. Yeah. Do you need help, like moving the body for the coroner or anything, well, or think, are we all sit? I think it's been, I think it's been moved already. Okay, all right. Uh, it was a bit of a nasty, nasty side as well. I don't want anyone looking at that. Okay, I understand. Thanks, Yuri. <sighs> oh dear. I 
I did some, uh, some ride along in earlier with uh, Mr. Seliger. Things were so pretty much outside. We have uh, one criminal coming out to be put on a horse. Thankfully, it's been. Please get a horse ready. Not bad. So this is the just first the report for you, man. Just stand by. Ah, oh, yes. Alrighty. I think that's back to the old way. I'll give you a hand up. There we go, jump up. And stand behind the horse. Uh. Where are we taking her? Ah, uh, she'll be going with Siska. Uh, we just got one more to come. Oh dear. Can you please not do that? I can't turn around, sorry. You have been on duty the entire time? Alright, I'm around. Hello. You comfortable back there, ma'am? Marcus. <laughs> yes, brother. Yes. Uh, Mr. Gold's back. Howdy, friend. Oh, let's go. Howdy, Walt. If you ever want to end up on the right side of the law, I, I give you a job sometimes. Shut up, jackass. Oh, you this is probably good people Sorry, with just man. bad motives. <laughs> we heading out now, Sledge, or are we waiting uh, for more? Stand by, one man. You gentlemen all good? Dun, dun. I'm ready to come out. The Sledge. Anyway. <clears throat> What the hell's a Dalmatian? That big hey. spotted horse there. Stop a dog. Oh. Under my horse, please, sir. I like your mustache. Right, Someone give him a hand up, ass. please. Oh, oh. He's, he's, he's strong as hell. Oh, okay, yeah. He pulled him pill up. Yeah, he's good. Alrighty. Where's Woodman? He's oh, deep. Jesus Christ. Fucking Valentine. Alrighty, we ready to go? Everyone got the horses? Oh, yeah. Uh... I'll be back, don't worry. Yeah, nah, all right, all right. You're good. I trust you. you. I trust you. Right. I trust you. Oh. Everyone grab their horses. We're going to move on the black border. Are you counting marshals? All right, the rest of you, Sheriff, don't let him forget uh, you asked me 450. Okay. You have a really <laughs> lovely <laughs> voice like Honey Whiskey. Well, I actually love Honey Whiskey. You said 400 yeah, yesterday. You're welcome. I'm Cynthia Wheeler. I'm a medical trainer. <laughs> oh, I'm Marcus. Some happy dog in the back one. Yeah, jump on the back with Harkness or ride Harkness as if he's a bit too woozy for me to show up. Well, come on down. Will, Someone grab Woodman. Yeah, right, Hassel. Right. Right. Would you all like me to ride along with you in case you need any? Jump, any of you all need medical okay, treatment, or any of you? Yeah, you got you, sure, I guess. Right. Uh, you sure seat. stay safe now. Thank you. I need more. Help. Oh shit. Don't kill your horse again, Woodman. It's gonna speed it up a little bit. <laughs> Wasn't there a guy with uh, wasn't there another fellow there on the ground? Fucking hell, Mark. I've got all these nah horses, then there's you. I'm like two people today in the back there with the shotgun. Sorry, ma'am, for your loss. Just gonna turn right here, just gonna avoid an area. Oh, yeah, head pops the crossroads. Cool. That spot's evil. That spot's evil? Oh, <laughs> uh, what was you okay your. The Fred's name, sir, so back off the Dalmatian horse. I don't know, I forgot his name. Okay, oh, it's just for the doctors. Uh, madam, do you know that fella's name? Ma'am, what's your dad's name? Ma'am, do you know your dad's name? Ma'am? 
Ma'am, you still there? You with us? Ma'am, you there? She might be a little bit scared. She seemed a little bit scared earlier. Two Walters. Oh, Jesus. God damn. That's all we need, another one. Yeah, that was very terrifying. Taking the left fork. Yeah, Woburn, that's one thing you definitely want to see. Two Walter Golds. Nah, but then they can both paint it like. That's true, but still double Walters is a terrible, scary thing. Did you hear his voice twice? Yeah. Ooh. Goldius Maximus is the third. That, that was <laughs> the fourth too, I think. Oh, damn. Oh, I got a concussion, apparently. Yeah, I need to find out his name to give to the Mr. Yuri. Yeah. Before we send her, we'll try and get her to talk. I think I'm going to have to uh, send both of these because I did both reports. That's all good. We'll try and get her to talk first. You, you smell nice. Who, me? I oh, know, the ma'am, the lady at the back Where of the door. No, she says I smell oh, nice. What do I smell like? I was just trying not to yell. Got gunpowder? You think, you think me smelling like gunpowder is nice? Y yeah. Try and take that as a compliment. I don't think I did. No, I didn't. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> I can be out of here. <laughs> My mule was completely submerged. You're right, Miss Sandra. I didn't see it. Oh. Do, do, do you want me to pluck it? Yeah, probably. All right, come on down, ma'am. You all right? The ride wasn't too too rough or anything. You feeling all right? You, you're you're all very scary. Well, look, we don't mean to be scary. It's just we gotta. We got to deal with some pretty scary things. Now, I understand you robbed the bank back there. I'm, I'm sorry. Dad told me that I I had to. Your dad? What was his name? He, he killed him. I. I'm not sure who killed him, man. But what what was your father's name? Fish. Fish. I'm named after my father. Hi, madam. I've, I've been asked to have a little uh, chat with you for a moment, if you, if, just for your medical records. If I could just get your name. F F Fish? Your name is Fish. Do you have a last name, ma'am? Smith. Fish Smith? 
You have lovely hair. Thank you. I quite I like yours as well. Just the bar, bar, uh, Can I also know your mm -hmm. father's name, if possible, for his medical record? I'm, I'm named after my, my father. So he's he's Fish Smith, and you're Fish Smith Junior. Yes. All right, and you're being honest with me because the best way that I can help your father's memory is by getting his correct details. All right, so I can give you. Yes. Yeah, yeah. All right. I will uh, give you back to these gentlemen, but uh, you know you have a safe travel over, right? And I hope you reform <laughs> yourself on your way out. You ready for a sledge? Can I go now? Do you mind if I, Captain? Do you mind if I take this one and this? It would be my first to try it. Sledge, my, Sledge, Sledge is inclined to believe that. Uh, uh no, you should be able to much better do it. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm afraid I'm, I'm perfectly capable of answering the deputy fellas. <laughs> <laughs> What was that, sorry? You got an issue there, Sledge? Work. Definitely not, Captain, sir. Oh, right, I heard, man, thought I heard a chuckle. Me. No chuckle, sir. No, there was a chuckle. How would you like to be suspended for the rest of the week? I would definitely not like that, sir. Oh, good. So I would fall the fucking line. Do that. Good morning. I don't think he's mad. Oh. Drama. All right, ma'am. Stay safe in prison. Well done, Cyrus. Thanks, sir. Just let me know um, when it tells you, and I can uh, accept that. Oh, can anyone accept? Anyone can accept, can't they? I don't know, Sledge. You seem to have all the answers. Why don't you tell us? I believe they can. Oh, oh, excellent. We'll go with that, then. How's that sound? I can't look inside your report book, sir. I don't have a report open, son. Shoppy, yeah. Uh, who has that lady's evidence as well? Uh, so I grabbed her firearms. That's it. Uh, when you are going to reports, it'll say locker next to accept. Just open that up. Put the uh, weapons that you took off, uh, not the one she shot at with, because that one is confiscated. The rest can be put in that locker. Okay, so I can open up, open up your report and edit that, uh, no, no. If you go to jail records in the uh, reports. Oh, got you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it'll be there as Fish. Was it Smith? Um, and then, yeah, just open up that lock, put the weapons in. Oh, there's a doctor on out. Yeah. Yeah, apologies about that before there, sir. Um, I was in my pockets and I could hear you asking a question and I uh, couldn't talk. Um, I don't know. I was try I, that's why I quickly answered, but yeah, I apologize. Well, it's not just that. It's the blatant display of disrespect time and time again. Now, we've had talks about this. Sledge? Now, I've had words with the sheriff, but this will be your, f your final warning. Don't want to be talking about this again. I don't care how it was over in the east or wherever you've been before. You're here in the west apartment now. We're following the instructions by Sheriff Bowman, hand-selected underneath the marshals. You'll show some damn respect and you'll fall in line. If we hear more of this, I'm going to take us more to the sheriff. I'm going to have you suspended, all right? Yeah, copy that. Well, don't you have reports to be finishing? I do. Well, I'll skip along, boy. Okay. Chop, chop. All right, so those weapons are in the locker for the away. Right. I'll just be doing my reports uh, just here, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared. Team sledge around. Oh, yes. Whereabout is he at the man? 
Uh, down at the docks at the moment, doing some paperwork. Oh, what a shift. Yep. All right, gentlemen, us rangers, we're gonna go home because we are okay. we are absolutely exhausted. That's all good. Oh, plus you got some of the play with down at Tumbleweed. Ah, <laughs> yeah, let's let's hope so. All right, ranger. Thank you, captain, for uh, for everything this evening. Oh, look, I wish wish our group could have been more help. We we were trying to find you as best we could. Look, you know, I Sorry guess it, it be happens. For you. It's all right, you know. It's uh, if it's not somewhere, it's somewhere else, right? You know. But uh, the main thing is, is you made the good call in in splitting. Because, uh, you know, we still keep that presence across the country. That's right. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. But either way, um, what fun we had. Well, that's the main thing. As long as you're safe and you had fun, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm riding in on a mule with some goddamn crazy outfit to try and get myself taken hostage <laughs> so y'all could swoop in on horseback and then just whirlwinds from there hurricanes god damn and look on bro. the ride back if you see a scorpion or something you 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 turn right around all right honestly i'm even thinking about maybe sleeping here in blackwater so we don't even have that odd against us by all means if you feel the need feel free to spend the night before you head out you know what ranger you ain't got you what are you doing <laughs> I'll probably hang around for a bit. So I'll head down Tumblebee. You know, see if I can handle it. Go, myself. go. Actually, go. If you're if you're still gonna clock on, go. Absolutely, get down there. Good luck, partner. Uh, George, we need to talk to the um. What's he called again? Oh yeah, the governor. The, the, the gov governor. That's right. Governor. Oh fuck. Rip, rip, what is it now? I don't know idea what he wants. The bank. I don't know. Hello. The boys, I heard there was a bank robbery. Uh, what's and that? I heard in that bank robbery, two hostages were killed. So, can someone tell me who was negotiating that? I, I, I believe Hughes and I were not there, so. I'm sure Harkness can, can tell him that, Woodman, uh, Canavan being his group. Sorry. Well, they wanted weapons. And money. We'll be told we can't I asked a fucking question. Who was negotiating? Obviously. Oh, Sledge was at the start. Then they, they it's a Sledge. What did these gentlemen ask for? Um, they didn't ask for any demands that we could actually give them. Uh, they requested money and firearms. Uh, which, from my understanding, uh, we are not allowed to give them money nor firearms. Um, and who told you that? It's pretty much from my training and everything. Well, here's what I got told. I had civilians coming up to me and the press now coming up saying that the governor doesn't give a shit about civilians because he told his uh, sheriff's department to uh, not, not give them money or guns when their lives are at risk. Now, I have two dead hostages, which luckily I'm hoping doctors have arrived and can go back to their families. And I've got to now a whole fucking town riding because apparently I'm the one fucking telling you boys not to do it. Now, who said that I said that? I did not say that, sir. Well, one of you fucking did. I'm going to get back next year as governor when I've got a whole town to believe I don't give a shit about them. <laughs> He's always about the, like, election. Oh, no one want to speak up? Is this what is this what the negotiations were like? You boys are just sitting there stuttering? Definitely not, sir. I pride myself on my negotiation skills, but that was borderline impossible. I believe the outcome was as it was just going to be. It was going to happen anyway. You're telling me, boys, you don't even have five dollars in your fucking pockets right now? You could have given them? It's, I've just been, you know, I just did what I was taught. All right. So what were you taught when it comes to them killing a hostage? Bridge. And why was there two hostages killed before anything happened? Uh, because when the first one was killed, um, we, I walked over to Harkness and I said, I gave him a little code word that we had, and then they shot the second one, and then they uh, we rushed inside. After the second one was down, the third one did survive, 
Um, the other two was Phoenix and one of Phoenix's friends. Uh, they would survive their wounds as well. They were helped by the local doctor. Well, thank God that's the case. So I get more two, two more people now going to be fucking barking up my fucking barking at my desk, telling me they want me out of desk. Yeah. Now I'll be I'll be real careful about what you boys put in that report. And I'll think carefully about the words you choose because if it's the words that I got told by one of the uh, one of the press, well, we might be talking about uh, you know, looking at another career for you. Do I make myself fucking clear? Yes, Crystal. I did not work so fucking hard to get to this desk to have it get a fucking undermined instantly by my sheriff's department lacking negotiations. I personally believe our negotiation skills were as best as they could be at the situation. Uh, they couldn't get into the bank, um, and I believe that they had hostile intent from the start, but I couldn't tell that until they uh, executed hostages. So. Look, I, I understand. I understand the situation was tricky, and look, no negotiations ever fucking easy. I, I've done a fair in my past. I, I, I understand, but I'm just a little worked up. I just had some... I didn't I woke I just I was in that fucking office writing a big old congratulation to my 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 depart my law department for bringing peace to law, uh, Blackwater and reducing uh, no longer having the martial law but to instantly write that letter and then be bombarded by the press about how I apparently told y'all to fucking not give you know the money or guns when their lives are, like, civilians' lives are at stake, well, fuck, that was the biggest kick in the balls I've ever had. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Roger, that's, um, I think we're also a bit rattled, because literally, probably two minutes before that, we were actually held up and robbed by uh, John Black and co. I'll be filling out an answer report. Uh, Harkness was shot. I took him to Valentine. That's why we were right there. Executed and a down with him. Uh, I don't know. They're all masked up except John Black and another yeah. gentleman I don't recognise. I was executed, so that wasn't good. Yeah, Jesus and we lost. Christ, boys. I had no sidearm. They could, they could um, I took my sidearm and shotgun. All I had was rolling block. So we're a bit rattled from that situation and the fact that if we did breach, all I have is a single shot rifle. That's why I negotiated, just in case they do leave. There would be a gentleman there with arms that would be able to fight if they do turn around. Um, Harkness was seeing two to three people at the same time, but he tried his best to keep composure. I believe personally, we did our we did what we tr our best at the time with the current mental state that we're in after our running with John Black and um, the posse that he was running with. There are ways that we can learn and do better, and um, I'd love to be able to uh, do better next time. I just don't know why we didn't get uh, any word that a bank robbery was happening down here. Uh, well, they they can't. Are broken. Uh, they so, can't get inside the safe or anything. So, uh, look, I, again, I understand the situation you boys are in, and sorry I've come off real hard. It's just, I, I've got a lot of shit on my fucking plate right now, and hearing that that these things are happening, I bit, look, I don't. Whatever happened, it happened, right? But all I want to see is, so I want to see some, you know initiative i want to I, I want there to be decisions made and it has to be quick you're gonna fuck up boys shit i fuck up on a daily basis have you seen my fucking assistant in my office he stands on my desk for some goddamn reason he's thick as a no, brick wall a horse shit on your rug. watch your words right now woodman i'm not in a good mood so all i want to see in those situations is some initiative you make the decision. You either you're either making sure they're coming out alive, no matter the cost, or you make you're making the decision to breach. You need to do something. You can't just stand on the sideline and wait. Because the more you wait, the more angry they get. People die. Copy that. Is there any chance we could, um, like I, as you stated, like money for hostage lives is acceptable. Um, is there any, can we just say, like, start with a number kind of thing, like a negotiation? Well, that's part of negotiation, boys. You yeah, can figure just, that one out. 
Yeah, I was just under the impression since day one that we're not meant to do gun, uh, weapons or money, but now they'll know. Um, next time, if it doesn't hap does happen, I'm sure that we can uh, provide uh, some monetary exchange. Now, I'm not, I'm not exchange. saying give them the fucking world, right? But this is the job of negotiating, right? You've got to try and do everything you can to get them out. If it's something too unreasonable, or they're asking way too much, well, you make that decision. I can't make that decision for you because every situation is going to be different. But the, the, the big key is you got to make a decision. Because if you hold on, well, you saw what happens when you don't make a decision. Or if you're too slow to make that decision. Yep. All right, boys, I'm going to have a fucking shitload of paperwork to do now. So look, uh, again, sorry I blew up you boys. I'm just... I just came out of the whole fucking roads, you know, situation with everyone getting killed and all the havoc that was happening there. It just got out of those lawsuits, and I'm sure this is going to lead to a new lawsuit, so oh, I'll worry about that. You boys get some uh, rest. You won't be buying a new rug anytime soon, then. <laughs> I told you I ain't in the mood, Woodman. Sir, so was it uh, Mr. Ingo who talked to you? Feels there. Oh. Seemed, um, seemed That's okay the only reporter we got. Yeah, I know that he was the reporter there, but you know, I had I had some other birdies tell me. Oh. Didn't catch the names because I was too busy trying to get ready to post up all those, you know, letters about the martial law being let down. So, all right, boys, I'm gonna go get this paperwork started. I th I think you boys. I don't know how you're feeling, but if you, you know, sounds like you've had a big day, maybe take some time off, think about it, or at least try and keep low and, you know, just make sure you're taking care of yourself, boys, all right? Definitely, sir. All right. Y'all take care. Yes, sir. I hope he has to buy a new car. Need that bath. Bath, 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 boss. Howdy. Get that fucking poncho off, Terrence. I swear to fucking God. Dodge. I'll rip that off and I'll throw it in the fucking river. I'll rip that hat off you and throw it in the river. You can well, damn well try. <laughs> I think the martial law's over, so like, get that goddamn punch off. It's like um uh in Simpsons where the um uh Smithers no, what's his name? Mr. Burns is to that guy's like next time I wanted no I said no sideburns. And it's like every time you see him, he's like shaved off like his head, he's shaved off like everything. He's like, still there's some goddamn sideburns. I said no sideburns. <laughs> Yay, Descendant. Oh, I'm all right, man. I'm just a little tired. There's a lot of drama in, in game tonight, which is interesting. It can be a little draining. It's like, I can't keep up with all this. Um... Keen for the weekend, though, man. I'll be seeing you Friday. Giddy up. It'll be good to see you, man. I went and got my new high-vis vest today. Because I don't think I packed my old one when I moved. Yeah, I don't know what, I don't know what that was about. I don't know what that was about, Cam. She just, yeah, just strangled... Woodman out of nowhere, and then couldn't even like hear her. Not even like using a, using a fucking mic. I don't know what the fuck that was about. Fucking new players. <laughs> it's kind of weird, you know. I was holding a ring. Uh, I was holding a ring. Uh, yeah. So I've been distressed, and you know this caused fights between me and Honey because you know she, she doesn't know what to think, even though I'm clear of everything you know what i mean like it's very stressful mm -hmm. to see me under such situations 
so I've gone down to the desert for a few days and um, just to give her some space that she needs. Oh, Please honey. give me for two seconds. I'm sorry George, that she's feeling like it. You're right. Well, Do you know how like the a, bank works? She, she walked in. No. And uh, not really. She no. saw six armed people oh, putting well, right. lawmen putting guns at me, and they Locks told her to get nine. lost. Uh, you, know, you know what I'm saying? And then when I told her what was over, she was like, eh. "Yes." So obviously, I wanted to give her some space to catch you, Cam, because you know it's caused tension and uh, emotions were high. So I needed to uh, give her her space and uh, unwind down in the desert because it's. My god, Nutties. Yeah, that is the reddest holster I've ever seen. And then, like... Uh, which I did, but, uh, so these Mexicans, uh, they gave me some of their uh, finest clothes and uh, taught me how to shave my beard. Oh, taught I, me uh, how me to too, shave but my I beard. wanted to fit in with them. It's a bit hot down there. But, yeah. It's, it's a very stressful time. Sounds like a... Yeah, a whole time. Well, anyway, hello, gentlemen. Yeah, it. Oh, Whose horse is in the alley? Oh, there he is, Mr. Roscoe! Look at yeah, that horse. Yeah, we're taking the Roscoe past the Speaking governor's which, house um, again. I might need to get some horse prices from you, see? Oh, oh that, I can give you prices, that but um, that I, horse. Drive, I drive trains now. Miss it, Honey's oh. um, the ho horse, uh, the stable manager. Or oh, all right. I didn't oh, know yeah, yeah. Spe Speaking of your old boss there, Alexi, you know where he is? Uh, no. Like I said, um, Miss Honey owns it now, but, uh, I, I bought the business off, um, Cal, so I don't, I haven't seen him for some time. Alright. You know, he likes to rob people of, uh, the, the most expensive guns, you know? Uh, like I said, I haven't seen him for probably, oh, I think it's the dance, maybe I saw him. But, I uh, since then, I, I, I don't know what he's been up to. He hasn't been in town. To, well, I've been in Mexico, so... What is it? What has Cal done? He stole my Springfield. Oh fuck! Say. Interesting. Why would he do this? I can confirm because unfortunately I witnessed it. Because he's an angry little boy. That's why. Oh. He's angry with the East Department. Yet yeah, yeah. he uh, robs the West. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll come show you. I will uh. watch the way he talks to the governor too. Hey. Well, I'm, I'm sorry. Watch the way you too. talk to the governor. He's in a shitty mood. So, what sorry, happened? I was just asking about his carpet. Yeah, I know that pissed him off. So, let's watch sure, what he talks about. Right. I'm waiting for him to go to bed. I'll take the horse back in there. We'll go again. Don't piss him off, woman. Okay. Oh, oh fuck's sake! All right, who wants to go to that? But uh. Oh, I mean, it. um... Governor adios. recommended some time off, Woodman, so feel free to clock off. I'm I'm gonna take his advice. Do we know if Governor's gone to bed yet? I don't know, I ain't his fucking butler. Alright. I feel like the horse is trying to talk to me. You must go to the Dagobah system. Mr. Roscoe's really amped up. I feel like he's trying to say something to me, but I don't speak horse. Yeah, he's saying oh. he can't wait for the governor to go to sleep. So oh, Mr. Hughes, can I borrow you for... I need to check up on your recent injuries. Can I borrow you in the clinic? Sure. I'll see you later, Todd. I might go hunting later. Okay. Took my Springfield with a scope. Seven hundred dollars. Fucking can't fucking escape it. I don't actually need to check your wounds unless you want me. But uh, I wanted to. Alexia was just telling me about a big raid on his belongings and everything yesterday. Yeah, you could say that. Well, I have something I can tell you. Okay. All right. So when I first came to county. And uh, Alexi was helping me out, and he gave me a wagon. Mm -hmm. He gave me a wagon that's a little blue wagon. And he panicked because he thought he gave me the wrong little blue wagon. Because one of them was filled with, in his mind, 
less than legal items. And he didn't mention exactly, but he <laughs> mentioned some bison furs and things like that. Mm -hmm. But he uh, he did clean house and get rid of that before y'all got to him. So if at all you want to see my little blue wagon and see what his might look like, but I just thought you should know that he did clean house and you were on the right track. What are you doing now? What? Not much. You're getting on the back of my horse. Oh, uh, okay. If anyone asks, we're going to get dinner in Saint Denis. Oh, okay. Cusin's at the end of his rope. <laughs> All right, get on. Oh, no, not that fuck, Chaos. Sorry, I'm at, I'm at the end of my... I'm at the end of my tether tonight. Yeah, I can tell. You remember how you said about the other day I had different energy? I'm getting that different energy from you. Just trying to get things done. I'll just have to get out of town and we'll see. Well, I'll just get my bearings. I need to find the Pinkertons. Post office at the nearby station. We'll stop there they, first. So they just hang out there? Or you send a telegram. I need to send a telegram out. See if I can get a hold of them. Because they can be hard to find. If they're not at their office, they could be. Well, they could. They could be hiding in my pocket. Yeah. Well, I would be worried about a detective agency that could be found. Now you got a good look at everything you saw inside that wagon? No, no, that's what I'm saying. I didn't get to see in the wagon because he had to check which one I had. And I had the one that didn't have the things in it. I just know that he was freaking out thinking he gave me the wrong one. That's enough. That'll be enough. He said specifically that there were two little blue wagons. That one that matched mine. Okay. We'll run with that. I didn't know you all were after Alexi, otherwise I would have volunteered this information sooner. Well, this came straight from You know from it was the... Alexi who gave me drugs in the county, in the streets of Blackwater a couple weeks ago, right? You didn't use him, did you? Remember when I told you I thought it was just a cigarette? Oh, yes. It was just after he uh, proposed to his honey? Do you still, do you have any more of those... It was a one time, one and done. Okay. All right. Come inside while I do this. Sure, I'll go in my head for just a second while you do that. Uh, telegram IDs, telegram IDs. Uh, where have I written this down? I think Louis is seven. Addy Looper.
All right, let's go. Hopefully they get that. If not, there's one place they should be. It's been... It's been a mixed bag. I don't think I've ever seen you this serious before. This is how the job gets. This is what expected of me as a captain. I need to get things done. I was there with with the inspector literally in the stable as he as he brought out wagon wagon after wagon with nothing nothing the only thing we could pin on him was was bison bison with bison horns or something The thing is, is that he said to me that he isn't a criminal, but in the same breath, he said, oh, yeah, I got rid of that wagon. Did he say where he got rid of it? I think he just cleared all the items out of it and did whatever knows with it, but you probably even saw the wagon now that it was empty. Shit. But he is also known for handing wagons out to just about anybody because he says he has too many of them. What else? And when he when he gave you that, not a cigarette. Did he say anything else? Uh, he said that it was my, the effects that I was experiencing were what he expected. He knows exactly what they are. He knows exactly what he did. And he gave you no warning about that. No warning, no. And it was my like my second day in county. I I never touched anything like that. Jesus Christ! What if you had had a negative reaction to that? I don't know, I fell over in the street. And at the time when I told you that that happened, I didn't tell you who gave it to me because I was, you know, I know better than to open my mouth. Did anyone help you when you're falling over in the street? Everyone was just kind of rolling around laughing anyway because there were more people on that than just me. Jesus fucking Christ. Goodness gracious. God, I hope they got my telegram. Been running into them all night at the worst times. And now when I need them, no sign of them. <laughs> you got one shot. Crimes oh, afoot. Cool. I have to say I'm feeling nervous having it now feeling like I'm being put into a, some sort of investigation. You're not in any trouble, miss. No, I, I know, and it's, it's sort of my my job now, I guess, is to, you know, help you. You just need to talk to each of the inspectors I can get a hold of. Give them your side. No, nope. they'll take all this information. They won't go... There won't be any record. I'll see to it that there's no record that it came from you. It can come from me if it sits with the Pinkertons. I don't want it to get back to Alexi that I said anything. I won't let that happen. I know now well enough that my name is going to be on some reports for the among the lawmen and among the Pinkertons and things like that. I'm a witness to a lot of things. And you're okay with that? Yeah, I think I've come to trust you, lawman. Do you trust me? You know I do. <laughs> he 
keep an eye for gators. Last thing we need is one of them snapping out our feet through this swamp. Don't <laughs> trust him as one evil eye. they got my message hopefully there's one in there waiting for us at it anybody in there this is it's George from the West Department hello anybody in here I remember coming here when it was still just the foundation. I haven't seen all their fancy offices yet. My God, how many investigators they got. Maybe someone's upstairs. Those are some very steep stairs. Jesus Christ. This might be the steepest stairs I've ever climbed. Shit, there's another floor. Jesus Christ. This oh my goodness, it's like a wizard's tower. What the hell? Oh, this leads to the oh, roof. Wow. This is excessive. This this is Aren't they meant to be discreet? This place doesn't seem discreet. This ain't discreet at all. Get those steps in. Shit. check my telegrams one more time just in case they've gotten back to me master uh, get up <laughs> oh my goodness i think i'm broken you all right miss can't get on the horse eh, now i'm on the horse all right off from there and the telegrams i have no idea no idea how I can get a hold of them. Well, you might need to take down a statement from me and then get in touch with them tomorrow. Yeah. It's just... And then tell them they can come and find me as well. They just, they like to be thorough. They would prefer to yeah. talk to you in person because they've probably got more questions that I, I, I ain't thinking of. Alright, I'll just be one minute. Come inside just to cases people watching there are some uh, gentlemen outside where over here Actually. Oh, thank you. Wow, 
Wait, me? Oh, yeah, probably. I got a bad memory. Too many people come up to me. <laughs> um, I think I do. Actually, no, I don't. Holy fucking shit. Who the fuck are all these people? Oh god. <laughs> oh god. Howdy. Howdy. Jesus. What the hell? Oh, Gotta check my the telegram. Bad. Fucking Excuse hell. Me coming through. Excuse me. No, stay here. Uh, going on, me. Yuri? I might wait my turn. Yuri? Be patient. All right, we're gonna line, I guess. Okay, you want to hit me <laughs> while I'm smoking a cigarette? Of course. <laughs> I didn't touch you. I'm doing squeeze. Hello, Mr. Hughes. I'm doing good. Hey, Where's the Lexi? Uh, oh, I can't. I'm I'm I need Board to use this train. Broken again. <laughs> hey, that's the governor. <laughs> governor. I can't check my telegram. Howdy, gentlemen. That's sad. Howdy. 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 You used up your quarter of telling me. How's your day going, mate? Uh, good. You look. Do you have a minute? Is this menacing? What? Sorry. I'm trying the to menace Man in the you. bowler hat. Yeah. yeah. You look like someone I know. Can I ask what? you a few questions? Yes. Yeah, sure. All right, let's go oh, to the train really station. Really? <laughs> I'm like horrified by that. I'll be waiting here. Oh. There you go, mate. I can help you. I didn't want to get up. Come on, miss. Lucky lose here. You don't want to rob me, are you? Lou, no, I'm not going to rob you. You know what? You're the second person today to call me Lou. Wait, what's your name? My name's Frank Stockburg, mate. Oh. What's your name? Shit, you look just like... You look like my friend Lou that I used to know. Ah, uh, do I? Nah, mate, it's not me. Yeah, my name's Frank, mate. Oh. Well, I, I do apologize, sorry. Sorry, Mr. Stockburn, is it? Yeah, mate, Mr. Stockburn. Uh, sorry about that. Sorry for the confusion. That's no, you're my, right, my mistake. Big, does your friend Lou have a big scar across his eye? Now you mention I don't think he does. No, no, probably. Everyone says I look like him, but yeah. All right, sorry about that. No, no, sorry. that's okay, mate. Like I said, you're not the first person today. <laughs> you're right, mate. Well, you have yourself a good one. You too, nice no worries. You. Sorry about You too, man. Sorry about that. Thanks. No, you're it's right, good to mate. see you again. Likewise. Well, that's not Lou. Shit. Unless he's being super secret, and that's a super secret Lou and hard. If I've seen Lou be pretty <laughs> secretive, but if, if, if that's Lou... Then that's the most secretive I've ever seen him. Yeah. Shit, okay. Don't no response from Lou. I don't know when I'm gonna get a response from Frank. They may they if they're out in the field, they may not check their telegrams for you know, till okay. tomorrow. Yeah, I think Alexi's outside, by the way. Shit, okay, let's go this way. Shit, yeah, down here. God damn it, of all the times, of all the places. Alright. Well, there's nothing more I... I don't think there's really anything more I can do tonight except just, just hang by that telegram station and just try and get word from him. But I don't want to hold you up, miss. Where, where can I... Um, it, it's fine. I can get Henry to take me back. He's very well healed now. But I might stick around in the St. Penny's doctor's office in case maybe as well. All right. That's what you'd like to do. And uh, I'm sorry for how abrasive I was earlier. I've had a rough day. Well, it's, it's fine. I just, just thought you might want to tell me all about it so you feel better. It It's all right. I'll, I'll be fine soon. It's just uh, I wish my new job was paying me money. <laughs> 
shit. How you doing? How you doing you know, on the money deposit? I know. I'm not. Nope. I'm not taking. I'm not. I'm not doing that. I'm. You. I know you're not. You're not asking for any. But I'm just asking. Well. I am. I have more money now than I did earlier. I have four dollars ninety nine cents. God damn it! Can I give you some money so you got some? No. So you got some no. food and whatnot. I'm. I've got venison and I've got game and I've got some pelts to sell and I have for once a warm bed in the doctor's office let's just step up from your tent out in the in the yeah. mud I heat. won't crash there every night because obviously patients need a bed but if there's a spare one I can you know oh yeah you gotta take care of yourself Miss Cynthia I, you know I respect that you know you're all about you know really embracing the lifestyle and and finding yourself and all that, but yeah. But I'm trying here, you know. I'm I'm trying to look out for you. I know, and I and I, I know that you've been looking out for me a lot, and I feel that a lot, not just you as well. There's a couple other people who've been really looking out for me this week, especially you know meeting Mr. Seliger, and uh, he keeps trying to give me money for things as well, and Woodman constantly telling me that I'm taking money from people is really just annoying the you're shit not, out of me, sir. So. You're not taking money from me. I'm giving it to you. But there's, it's still like, it's just sort of the same, though. And I, I want to prove to me and prove to you that I can, I can do it. I know, but I don't want you out starving to death. I'm not gonna starve to death. I'm resourceful. I told you I'm trying to I'm trying to get my act together and be more responsible. You are responsible. What, whatever did I say that made you think that you weren't responsible? I, I, you've been talking about Miss the governor, how he's, how he's treated Louisa at the at the dance, and you've been talking about Woodman taking Louisa for granted and that. I'm trying to, I'm trying to make steps to show you that, that I can be counted on. You can be, and you're my friend, and I, I trust you, and it's it's all fine. Tr I just want to, I'm finding my legs here finally. I just want to, I want to keep finding my legs, and I'm going to show everybody, not just you. I'm going to show everyone that I can do it. All right, if you're sure. And then when I when you notice that I can do it, and I hand you like a fat stack of cash, you're going to celebrate with me, and we're going to have a drink. I don't, I don't need the money back. But I'm I'm gonna do it. It's a matter of my principle. All right, I can't I can't stop you. It's fine. We're fine. I'm gonna make the money. I'm gonna sleep in a nice warm place tonight. I've got venice in the cook, and I've got a bag full of bandages and cocaine paste. And I, I things are I'm moving up in the world. It's going well. All right. I, I've got my shit together. I promise I'm not in any danger. All right. Well. All right. Well, I'll let you know and, if I hear anything back from the Pinkertons. And if I'm in dire straits, I will come to you. I promise. Okay. All right. All right. Now you need to stay safe if you're going to be lingering around for the, the, the post. Oh, I ain't lingering by this one. I'm heading out of town to somewhere a bit more discreet. Okay. Well, I'm gonna make my way to the doctor's office. You uh, maybe get out of town over the railroad at the back. All right. Or I'll be I'll, I'll be seeing you, Miss Wheel. Bye. If only there was a train right now. Be the perfect time to get a train. Quick, what's the command? Like, just spawn in a train. It's a long ride back, and I'm paying for the boat, unless I have to. Oh no! Where did I leave my horse? Oh, why is it sporting over there? Oh god! There you. Is there a station? Uh... Roads, it is. I 
Oh, damn, it's raining. Following me. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Camp here. Oh, uh, where's the gate? Oh, it's getting cold. I've even got Ugg boots on, but my toes are cold. It's not fair. The Ugg boots are supposed to protect my feet. Blank. Shit, nah, I, I don't expect I'll hear from Frank anytime soon. It's certainly not going to hear anything from Lou if Hammer's on Frank. That is bad timing. Um, oh jeez. Oh dear. Uh, let's just get back to Blackwater, I think. Oh my god. Really? No! Piss off! <laughs> I don't want cheap viewers! Be gone! Leave me alone! I don't know, can't like, so it's... A lot of them are bots, like, they're all automated. But I swear there was one time, like, a couple of years ago, I was streaming and a message like that came in. You know, get this here or blah blah blah. And I was like, as I sometimes do, I was, you know, speaking aloud, being like, oh yeah, I'll go there. Oh, oh. Yeah, making fun of it. And then the, and then the, they started replying in chat. They're like, why are you saying that? Like, they're like, I'm like, whoa, there's actually someone there? It was so fucking weird. It was so weird.
don't know who all those people were, but I'm kind of, I have a feeling that it might be good that they may not have seen me. I got a bad feeling about people that may be riding around this area right now. feel like some of the people that we've been on the lookout for tonight would be roaming around between towns in a place like this robbing people and it'd be very bad if they spotted George Hughes while he's out here off duty alone Zoom, zoom, zoom! Ride like the wind, bullseye! <laughs> oh no, what happened, Shelby? Uh-oh. Gunfight. Oh, now a train's leaving St. Denis. Now... Where was it? Where was it five minutes ago? God damn it. God damn it. Oh god, okay. Nope, don't want to be on that train. Nope. Nope. All aboard the drug train. Ha <laughs> ha. Where's this fucking shortcut that I'm always missing? I need to get it imprinted in my brain. I need to just ride back and forth here until it's stuck in my head because I've been... I'm in Ryan the slow way. Oh, it feels like a fucking year. Can I hear wolves? Submarine horse! Who the fuck is that? <laughs> Did I just give someone the slip or was it just a coincidence? Yo, snaps! Is this the quickest way? I think it is. A little bit there by the bridge. By the track. What's here? 
And then it's here. But no, that's it. That looks too deep. That looks too deep to me. That does not look good for a horse. Horses have feelings too, you know. Magic. Hello. Howdy. Oh, hi, Mr. Hughes. Hey, you doing? I'm good. How are you? Oh, look, I've been better, partner. Oh, what's going on? Oh. You know. Just life, job, oh. women, criminals, oh. weather. That's beautiful weather. What are you talking about? Look at it. Not on the back, way back here. It's just fucking raining all me up from here to St. Denis. I, I was just here saying that like, you weren't raining. It's raining on the ride back for me. Oh, that was weird. You might be on a different plane of, of, of consciousness. I'm sure you weren't just crying, George. It's alright if you were. I'm trying to ban the fucking bot. Look, Mr. Billy, maybe a little bit. It's alright, Mr. Hughes. We all go through tough times. No, it's not, it's Billy. I can't yeah. do anything right. Well, I, I, I don't really know what you've done wrong, so I can't comment on that situation. Every day, Billy, it's another mistake. The lawmen under me don't follow my orders. They just say whatever they goddamn want. The sheriff's barely around. Just want him to teach me more, but I can't, can't find him. Then it's even harder to get a hold of the marshals, the governor. I feel like I'm, sometimes I'm thrown in the deep end without a paddle. I'm just, oh, I can't, I I'm just cruising down shit, Shit's Creek towards the waterfall. Well, I, you gotta change your outlook, Mr. Hughes. Don't think of it as you got to lead them and you gotta be your sheriff. Think of it as you get to lead them and you get to be your sheriff. I'm a captain, goddammit. I'm trying to make well, a difference. Well, there you go. Some people got nothing. At least you got brotherhood, even though they might not listen to you. I'm, I'm, I'm darn sure they gonna shoot back if people shoot at you. They might do. I just wish they'd... Just wish they'd communicate with me a bit better. I'm trying to look after them. Well, I'm trying to read told, their minds. Have you told this to them? I've tried. Like, God damn, I've tried. Well, y'all try a little harder, Mr. Hughes. Just go get shit before it gets better. I don't know. It just feels like... Feels like I just keep getting a dealt a rough hand. And hey, you know, and I'm what just they trying say. to, I'm trying to, you know, take advantage of the governor and the sheriffs and that tell us, you know, oh, take, take time off, you know, make sure you keep a clear head. So I'll try to, try to put myself out there. Try to, wow. try to spend some quality downtime. I mean, a nice young lady. But then, uh, you know what I do when I take her out to a dance? What happened? Ah, uh, bloody. F Follow up a g bottle of snake bite whiskey mojito, vomit all over myself, make a damn fool. Oh. Well, I, I'm a man of God, Mr. Hughes. And you you want to know what I live by? What's that, Billy? God <laughs> gives his toughest battles to his strongest warriors. Shit, I'm... I've been... I've been battling my whole goddamn life, Billy. My name's Bobby. 
Bobby, I'm sorry. <laughs> you're right. Bobby, I'm really sorry. No, oh, you're <laughs> It's just, it's, it's a lot, Bobby. Uh, till recently, I haven't really, I haven't really told anyone this, but, but it's just, uh, I carry a lot of demons, Bobby. You know, uh, I used to have a wife. Had a, had a, had a child. But, 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 but they were killed. They're taken from me, Bobby. I'm sorry to hear that, Mr. Hughes. No, I've, I've just been... I've been trying to turn my life around ever since. I just can't shake that feeling of failure. It just feels like everything I touch dies. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's a lot, Bobby. I'm sorry. You, you call me at a... Oh, no, me at a bad, you're you, fine. You call me at a real bad time, Bobby. I'm, I'm, sorry, well, for, you, I'm sorry for laying you, all this on you. You want to know what motto I live by, Mr. Hughes? <laughs> What's that? It's not who we were or what we did that defines us. It's how we react to what we did and what happened to us that does. Oh. You, 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 you face some struggles, I can tell. Hey, now, I, 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 I'm not too good at, at, con, at consigning, but I can tell you got to work through this, mister. Now, it's got like I said, it's gonna get it's gonna get worse before it gets better. But but for how you, long, Bobby? For how long? How long do I have to? How long do I have to go through this till I get through to the other side? As long as you can, Mister Hughes. As long as you can. Oh, I'm trying. I'm I'm am scared, Bobby. This martial law. It, it came. It ended today. But we've we've had we had bank robbers shooting hostages. We've got the governor breathing down our necks. We got people running up and down the street, shooting things up, graffiting. We got well, why, why we got woodmen. We we got woodmen. They they took his they took his Springfield rifle. You know you know how much oh. that Springfield rifle cost him. Oh, not the Springfield. Seven, I heard that's his prize possession. Seven hundred dollars. Oh, he, he only bought that yesterday. And he's no. already lost it. No, oh. Would have been staying to the right for Mr. Oh, Bobby. He's so right, Mr. Hughes. He he's worked so, so right. hard in that mine. He's a he's a he's a troublemaker, but he's trying his best as a as a deputy. I'm trying to get through to him, and I try to we try to tell him don't take your fancy guns out on patrol. But he's just so goddamn proud. Sometimes trying is all we can do, Mister Hughes. It's it, it's just hard if it's not if it's not my mistakes. I'm trying to be strong for those around me, and I just I can't help them either. You're a very brave man, Mister Hughes. But sometimes you can't help people that want to be helped. I just wish I could. You know, click my fingers and bring him back at Springfield, but. It, I can't. Oh, we all wish it was that easy. Unfortunately, life's just tough out here. It is. Whether it's snakes, cribs, outlaws, or Walter Gold, life's just tough. <laughs> it is. You've been a... I really appreciate you taking the time to listen to all my ramblings, Bobby. Oh, you're fine. I don't got no place to be. I'm just an unemployed fisherman. <laughs> oh, sometimes I'm... Sometimes I wonder if I should just throw it all away and just... No, don't do that. You just Maybe. need brakes. If you go and stick yourself to, to, to a pole, how are you ever going to get unstuck? You got to do it in periods. You got to touch the pole and then run away. Then you come back, touch it again, and then run away. You might be running your whole life, but at least it's going to be better than just sitting there or sitting duck. That's right. That's You got a lot of wise words, Bobby. You ever, you ever thought of... When you're not fishing, you ever thought of writing a book or something? No, but I, I do pray. You're, you're a religious man? Yes, sir. I don't drink no alcohol or nothing. Does that help? No alcohol? Oh, definitely. Alcohol makes it, it... I call it an amplification. If you're happy, alcohol will make you happy. If you're in your sorrows like I believe you currently is, well, your sorrows will turn to a deep depression. Well, I don't really, 
I don't really know. It just... The alcohol recently just made me more clumsy than usual. I, I, look, I like to have my mind always, always clear, and alcohol definitely don't help that. Maybe I should, uh, maybe I should steer clear of the drink then. It, recently all it's done is, it's caused nothing but trouble. It does say it. How about we pray, Mr. Hughes? Well, I'm not really much of a religious. It's okay. I'll do it for you. You just got to follow, all right? All right, I'll try, Mr. Bobby. <clears throat> Dear Heavenly Father, we no, come before you with a heart oh, full of hope and faith, seeking your guidance and strength. Life can be challenging, and sometimes the road ahead seems uncertain. Yet I trust in your infinite wisdom and love and kindness to God, Mr. Hughes, through his tough times. Please grant him the courage to face each day with a positive outlook and the resilience to overcome any obstacles that come in his way. Help him to see the beauty in each moment and to appreciate the blessings, both big and small, that you bestow upon him. Give him the wisdom to make the decisions that lead to a brighter future and the strength to persevere when he feels weak. Surround him with love, support, and encouragement and help him to be a source of light and positivity for others as well. Lord, I pray for your peace to fill his heart, for your grace to guide his steps, and for your love to comfort him in his times of doubt. May he always remember that with you by his side, there is no challenge too great, nor no burden too heavy. Thank you for the promise of better days ahead, and for the assurance that you are always with us. I place... My trust in you to guide him, and I look forward to the wonderful plans you have for him. In your holy name, I pray. Amen. That was gorgeous. Wow. Thank you, Mr. Bobby. I, I didn't know I needed that. All right, Mr. Jesus. Go get better. Trust me. All right, Bobby. I'll, I'll take your word for it. I'll try and take a page out of your book. I no more alcohol. It's the devil's juice. Leave it. That's right. I'm gonna. It's for it's for cleaning outside wounds, not inside wounds. All right. I'm gonna take all the, all the all the devil's drink I've been hoarding. I'm gonna I'm gonna give it out to people. I'm gonna get rid of yes, it. Yes, sir. I'm gonna get it yes, out. Yes, sir. I'm gonna get. That's what I'm gonna we cast like it to out. hear. Yes, sir. That's the way. All right, Bobby. I appreciate. All righty, gentlemen. Appreciate it. I'm not gonna hold y'all up too long. I'm gonna head back to me and chuck all my shit away. Tools. Also, by the way, did you know that they don't let you put fishing rods in wagons because the uh, the man calls it a weapon? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, so there you go. Little info for the night. See y'all later. Stay safe. Goodbye, Bobby. Toodles. How are you, Captain George? Oh. I tried to find the Pinkertons, but I had no luck. Yeah. So I've sent out some telegrams. Hopefully you can get them some of the information they need. So that we can... Bring what these criminals have got coming for them. Yeah. We've just, just... Uh, been told by the East to expect to be robbed every day at the moment by the John Black Posse. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yep. That's just what uh, we need after martial law. Yeah, we just went and spoke to uh, the East um, off duty. And we're just like, a bit more information about why we're getting robbed every in the West. And uh, they worded us up a bit, and they said, expect it for a while. And I'm like, why? I was like, we're not giving our weapons back. I was like, okay, that's fair. Um, but this, like, feels like we're getting punished for some other person's, you know, mistakes. Or not mistakes, I should say, but some other person's misfortunes. Yeah. God damn. All right, well, let's keep an eye out for them. Watch out for each other and just... Yeah. Oh, here we go. That would them. Yeah. <laughs> the lights are very bright on the other side. I can barely see. I see a little silhouette of a woodman. Yeah. <laughs> woodman. Woodland woodman. <laughs> hey, doing Todd. Hi. Hey, woodman. Oh, dipshits are looking for us again. Oh yeah. Guess what? So I I'm riding back from uh this way from like roads, right? Going along. See how to call my eyes horse. Turn around, get the binoculars out. Turns around and starts coming towards me, right? 
as it gets to me, another horse passes me. George, which was you. What? You t I passed you? Yeah, you passed me, and guess who was on the other horse? Who? Cowden. You gotta be fucking kidding me! <laughs> I'm not even joking! <laughs> he thought I was you. He was about to shoot me in the head. And I'm like, whoa, what's going on? He's like, I'm looking for that George Hughes. I'm like, uh, he's like, give him a message for me. I'm like, okay. So he's, he's looking for you. Oh, fuck. Well, I already knew that. No, but he's specifically looking for you out of all of us now. Well, why is uh, he, he... Actually, he actually left me alone this time. He didn't take any of my shit, but I was like, God, God damn it, you missed that. Like, <laughs> they, didn't want, they didn't want to take any of my shit, apparently, but then they fucking... Then that fucking well, if he's got a problem with me, he can come... Oh, he knows where he can goddamn so, find so me and he, stop hounding the rest girl, of you. He was with a girl with blonde hair and a guy wearing a blue shirt. God damn it. Just so you know. But, uh, yeah, yeah, this was, this was near roads. And I was like, what? And then you come flying past. I'm like, oh. Yeah, I was, I was coming from St. Denis. I wanted to get back here as soon as I could. Yeah, no, no, that's fair. As I said, you know, I just saw this horse out the corner of my eye and I got the binoculars and I'm like, oh shit, that's Caldern right there. Well, shit, any of you see him and he brings this up again. Tell him he knows where he can find me. Yeah. I'll be, uh, do that, sir. Uh, oh, and I, I bumped into Dinger. I went to have, uh, see Dinger in, uh, Dinger. in Thing. I said, mate, you know, uh, what's happening to that Carcano that freaking Caldern so freaking riled up about? He's like, oh, it's in evidence. You can't touch it. And then uh, Cal I told Caldern that again. He's like, well, you make you get that. I kind of like, how? It's gone. So, yeah. If I was there. Hey? I, I would take uh, his side sheriff hostage, point a gun at his head, walk him in there, and say, you take that shit out, or fucking kill every single one of you in here. Yeah, I don't know why he hasn't done that, you know? I don't know why we have to get robbed of our shit. That's if I was a criminal. <laughs> yeah, no, that's completely understandable, yeah. That'd be the most direct cause, wouldn't it? Because where else is it? The evidence locker in Saint Denis. You know, holding us up in Valentine and going, oh, where's my gun? You know, it's not going to really do much. We can't get her out of there. And if they say no, you just execute one of the sheriffs and continue to do it. Mm-hmm. And then grab the next one. Keep going. Until they give uh, the of away. course, this is all for legal reasons. A joke, yes? Yes. Yes, 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 why up to back a station no? It's out there. <laughs> Alright, y'all. Stay safe yeah, the rest yeah, of the night. No with you. Sure. I'm heading back just, to the uh... farm. I'm gonna write some stuff up and hit the hay. Oh good. Yeah, uh, you, uh, George, I'm I'm not, I'm not annoyed at you or anything. I just said yeah, it's just awkward that I, I missed you by like <laughs> seconds, you know? No, it's it's fine. It's just, you know, Pardon? horses are just so fast. Everything's a blur. Yeah, we probably would have been anyway. fucked anyway. There was three of them, so. No, you think banks been closed at night? Lucky, like lucky my horse has really, mm -hmm. I understand really it, picked up the pace lately. Yeah. All right. Uh, I'll see you. All right. <laughs> my goodness, that was funny. Bunda, you funny bugger. <laughs> what a hoot. Oh. Oh, what the fuck? Oh? 
What? These duels are so weird. They're so weird! <laughs> Stupid doors! Alright. Let's call it. Ugh. Whoops. Not the settings! Oh my god!